thousand years ago, the gods waged a petty war that shattered the world. Five powerful wizards joined together to save what remained. What was left was a floating mountain above a storm of eldritch fault from the gods' war. So essentially what's happening right now is that it's a thousand years since the five great powerful wizards pretty much used their powers combined to lift a mountain high above into the sky above all this purple lightning and fallout. It's been a thousand years and the five have kind of become estranged from everyone else. They rule the world with an iron fist and they do terrible, terrible things. <coughs> But everyone has kind of grown accustomed to it and just lives day to day, all right? Um, the four of you, you guys are a group. You're part of the uh, Lawless, essentially a group of people trying to fight against the tyranny of the Five and just kind of gain some semblance of freedom, okay? Um, for the viewers at home, um, the Lawless are individual cells. The only way they identify themselves is by having a piece of yellow hidden discreetly on their body and when questioning so <laughs> yeah. that might be a little too much that's, um, that's more orange too but, but I, did, I did it yeah that works that works too um, but <laughs> when someone says is your journey far your response yeah. is I, I know, know the way. way good great okay so um, what's happening right now is that you guys have special orders um, so, sorry, the lawless communicate via dead drops. Um, coded messages left the route, and you guys have been communicated to that uh, your mission right now is to get the um, Kadri cloaks. The Kadri are essentially the Five's uh, police force, and by getting these cloaks, you can gain special entrance into the Tower of Five. Because eventually, you're going to go for one of the sacred, ar the sacred artifact of the Drifting City, which is the fire. And, uh, yeah. So we'll start from there. So, the four of you gather um, up onto the surface of the floating uh, city, and there's this like wind that blows steadily through, okay? Um, you guys know that they, um, because it's a floating city, winds can get really high and very dangerous and can easily blow you off. Luckily enough, it's not so bad, you're able to plant your feet into the mountain. Uh, you guys are right now just outside a cadre barracks in order to get the um, the cloaks. And there are these two stone doors right in front of you. You've already investigated the barrack building and you've noticed that because it's built inside the mountain, there are no windows. And the only way in is through these doors. So, what would you guys like to do? Would you guys like to just open the doors, walk in, or kick it down, or? Let's try and sneak it. You're gonna try to sneak in. Kicking it down sounds so sneak, fun, sneak but I do have good sneak ability, so we'll stick with that for now. Sure. Go ahead and give me a stealth check. Uh, which one am I rolling? It's a d20. Okay. 13. And 13 plus your okay. stealth. What's your stealth at? Uh, eight. Eight. Okay, so that's a 21. You stealthily, quietly push the door as much as you can, and because physics still exists in this world, the wind blows in. Um, all of you, please roll perception. Fifteen. Four. Seventeen. Fifteen. One. One. Oh. <laughs> so I got that out of the way early. Uh, luckily enough, the three of you um, uh, are able. Oh, I should actually introduce your oh. characters. That's so, fine. Kelly, what are you? I am Sam. I am the cleric. Where are you? Can you point? Oh, and I am. That's I have you. a cloak on. Okay. Cool. I am Ashura, I am the drunken astral monk. I am the one here in red and black with the bladed weapons in my hands. I'm Brick, a half elf, half orc bard. Mm -hmm. Okay, and I am a Bridget, a urchin human thief, and I'm the, the cool ninja. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Um, as you push the door open, uh, the three of you, uh, Ashura, uh, Brick, and Bridget, you hear Dwarven voices go, Oi! The wind! Hurry on in! Close that dang door! <laughs> well, we all just, I just go in. Alright, you just go that's right cool. on in. Uh, that's you. Boop. Everyone else? Are you guys just gonna yeah. follow through? Alright, cool. Everyone goes in. Kelly, are you going in? Sam, are you yeah. going in? Okay, yeah. cool. Alright, you, you guys. Sure you noticed us going in? Because you didn't really notice a lot there. <laughs> <laughs> 
All right, inside you notice that there are two dwarven guards right here at this stone desk. Mm -hmm. And you can all see that they're playing, they were playing a card game, but when you open the door, the wind blew in, and the cards are everywhere. Uh, you can see a small, pile, a small pile of coins as there, is, uh, there as well. Um, what also you notice is right here are two um, uh, statues, like metal knight statues, that uh, stand very, uh, very imposing. So they look to you, they're kind of annoyed. State your business. Oh, I'm sorry, I don't want to get off the wrong foot. <laughs> I, I will help you pick up your cards. I'm sorry, we opened the door, so I'm going to help you pick up your cards, actually. That's very nice if you can roll me persuasion. Nine. Plus? Oh, uh, what am I doing there? You. Persuasion. persuasion. P. Uh, Plus four. Persuasion, zero. zero. So just no, nine. No, no, no. We're, we're in the, the, the barracks. That we're just, uh, the barracks. I'll be we're honest, I have an ulterior motive here. We're trying to, to get, get cloaks, cloaks first before the tower. Cloaks before okay. the tower. So, so nine gives me what? Am I trying to... The cloaks oh. are, are kept? I rolled a three. Okay. <laughs> they seem uh, very convinced oh. by your, uh, your, you know, your compassion to help clean. Mm -hmm. uh, so you join them in help picking up the cards. Okay. Um, as you do so, what, what would you three guys? I'm gonna, oh, well, to I say it. that we're all new recruits. Oh, okay. We're enlisting in the cadre, and I have, um, what is it, deception? Oh, yeah, go ahead and roll me deception, four? please. Okay. Yeah. Callie, don't ruin this for Nine me. plus four, 13. Nine, 13? Please don't ruin this for me. I was going to say we're from the laundry Five. and we want to pick right. up the cloaks, but I think your <laughs> thing was better. <laughs> no, uh, Sam, you, you're, 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 uh, you're, gumption, your bravery, just to lie to these two uh, dwarf guards, pays off. Oh, really? If, if that's the case, just go right on through. The training room's right there. Uh, okay. <laughs> and <laughs> they're pointing, and they're pointing to right over here. That's where the door is. As I'm helping them put the cards on the table, I want to pull some sleight of hand and steal some of the, the coins that are on the table. Oh, bold. All right, go that ahead. My sleight of hand's pretty high. 14. I'm at disadvantage. Nine, but my Four. sleight of hand is plus five, so 14. Because um, they're distracted by cleaning, uh, you have they have disadvantage. I roll in, roll to four. Uh, you're able to grab some coin and put it into your pocket with a slight jingle jangle of coins. Very, very hard to hear. Okay. okay. Um, you can count that later. You don't know how much you've taken, obviously. Cool. Do you cool. guys want to go through that door now? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, cool. cool. yes. You want to do some cards as well? No, let's just go. <laughs> All right. <laughs> I well, so, I wanna... so, push yeah. What would you like um, to do, Sam? Wait, oh, I want to look around just to see sure. if there are any cloaks laying around. Yeah, give me a perception check. Okay. Uh, I'm rolling really terrible. These Six plus five, five eleven. Open. Eleven. <laughs> so you take a quick glance oh, around oh, as you approach the door. Uh, the two uh, guards yeah, obviously yeah. do not have any cadre cloaks at all. Yeah. Um, but instead, what you see behind this wall like as you approach statues. the door, you notice that there are three cells. And right here, down this angle, you notice that the there statues. is a uh, dwarven woman staring at the group curiously. Oh. Okay. I'm going to go into the new room. You're going to go into the room. <laughs> All right. All right, before, I want to check out those statues. Do those have some kind of... Uh, so are you going to walk behind the guards to get to the statues? No, I just want to look at them more closely and see if they yeah, can... Yeah, sure. Um, give me... Uh, yeah, give me a perception check. Okay. Nine, Nine plus... Uh, perception a plus four. 13. So 13. As you approach, you start to look, and you notice that uh, on the chest is the, the cadre symbol. But as you stare at it more, you get the sense that this drawing, the symbol on it, is magical. Mm. Um, you could try to signal to the group to, you know, maybe one of them can do a really, uh, do an arcana check. Or you could yell out loud in front of the guards. Well, I do have the, the thieves can't. I'm good at communicating me. secretly. But they don't have thieves can't. Hmm. Yeah. Well, still. I'm sneaky. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, if I could communicate one of, to okay, one of so, them. So, to so, so what, do you, what do you say to them? I say, uh, <laughs> arcana. <laughs> <laughs> All right, give me an insight check. The three, give me an insight check to see if you understand his magical. Fourteen. Fourteen. Uh, twenty-three. Twenty-one. Twenty-one. <laughs> oh wait, insight. Yeah. So plus five is uh, nineteen. Nineteen. Okay. Um, you take a quick look, glance to see the uh, the the cadre symbol on it, and you start to notice that there's also small runes built around it. 
Um, you get the sense that there is a magic spell placed on the statues, making them essentially animated golems. But uh, you don't know what triggers them. Okay. Maybe an alarm bell or something like that. Yeah, yeah that might that. be dangerous. Yeah. <laughs> but, you know, all right, so there's some beware. So you're going in, so uh, Brick is going inside. I'm just going to, like, slow pace walk Slow pace, yeah. yeah. Confident, walk with yeah. confidence, yeah, of course, you're a bard. You just walk right on in. Anyone else? Are you guys following suit? I stumble, but with him, because I'm a little drunk. You're a little drunk, <laughs> sure. All right, a little drunk, you go in as well. Okay. I'm going to, while everyone, while they're kind of distracted by everyone going in there, I'm going to go see if I can quietly walk over to the cell. Sure. Are you, are you going to do that blatantly? <laughs> um... No, while they're going inside, kind of sneak around behind Okay, give me, give, me a, give me a stealth check. Yeah. And how about That's you, Bridget? Okay. <laughs> 15. 15, I'll, I'll nice. I'm kind of waiting by the door right now. Okay, you're going to wait by the door. That's perfectly fine. <laughs> um, as you guys open the door, and Sam's back. going towards the, the cage right there, um, Brick and uh, Ashura, okay. you see four people, and there's the sounds of like martial training going on. <laughs> Is that martial training? App apparently so. Hey, I'm doing the best I can! <laughs> so, uh, you hear people are just swinging and then grunting. Ja! Ja! Um, can I get, uh, Brick and Ashur, uh, can I get a perception check? Oh, and I, actually, Bridget as well, since you're still by the door. Ugh, that's a good. 8 plus... 19? 19? Wow. 13. 13? 13. 13? Yeah, so 18. 18. So all of you notice that there are three um, initiates. Uh, they have like these wooden swords and they're just swinging them <coughs> all together. And right here is a veteran. He's got some really nice, sweet looking gear. Um, I'll tell you right now, he doesn't have a cloak on him, but he's got very nice armor and he's watching them train. Um, let's go to Sam real quick. Sam, you approach the dwarf. The dwarf stares at you cautiously. She's a uh, little wary of you as you approach by yourself confidently, unsure of what to think. Uh... <laughs> Can I ask her that, the question? Do you know the way? Is that all you say and all you do? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> when you say it and that's all you do, she kind of backs away, just stares. Oh, okay. Are we, um, am I in the same room as her? No. Uh, you no, want to roll perception to see if you hear it through the door? Two. <laughs> perception, five. I don't think I heard it. So. No, no, you didn't hear it. You didn't hear it. <laughs> the dwarf so backs awesome. away extremely cautiously staring at you. Um. Oh, I can show her my yellow All right. Pin. As soon as you do so, um, the dwarf... From underneath her shirt, she pulls out a yellow sash, there it and is. she says, okay. um, "I know the way." Well, and well, she well. comes close to the bar, and she seems much calmer now. Okay. So she stares at you and says, "What are you guys doing here?" We're, I say, we're on a mission. Do you have any information about where the cloak might be? No, that's what it said. One roll, see if she knows. I saw a couple guys come on in. They went inside. They had cloaks. Inside the doors? They went in. That's all I can tell you. Okay. I've been locked here for some time now. Okay. Hey, can you get me out of here? Can you just unlock this? Uh, I'm going to see I'm gonna try if and this is on our way out, we might be able to make a distraction for you. <laughs> okay. No. Sounds good. I'm going to go over and I'm going to... But I'll say, I'll unlock We're it. We're in a room, aren't we? Are we? No, no, she, no, he's not. Oh, you're she's not. Outside. Bridget's right here. Okay. She's right there. Yeah. yeah. You, you can hear this conversation. Yeah, yeah. you can walk over. The I'm, guards are just playing cards. So I'm going to try and... Uh, yeah, give me a thieves tool roll. Okay. Yeah, well, you got plus eight. The same. Jeez. Six, six, six. Cool. Yeah. I think all right. <laughs> so with the really 24, well. you pull out your tools, and you just kind of fiddle for all of two <laughs> seconds. <laughs> I'm going to pop it. <laughs> cracks um, open. Could be useful. And uh, the lock is such an old lock, it actually drops. <gasps> Ooh, can I catch it? Yeah, yeah give me a dick save. Oh, please catch it, please catch it. 19. Yes. Oh, okay. With the deafness of Ooh. years of experience, you just, like, catch it, which professionally is, like, do you want to pocket it or just put it on the ground? Uh, 
Yeah, I don't think we need it, right? We're gonna give it a little pocket. <laughs> Alright, I'll pocket it. You pocket it, sure. <laughs> yeah. Alright. Okay, and I'm just gonna ask her, don't leave until until we're getting out of here. <laughs> you got it. And she stays quiet <laughs> okay. and uh, waits for you guys to leave. So we're gonna go into yeah. the room now. So at this point, all of you are now together <laughs> in, in a brief moment. Um, those three guys are training. And the veteran, he approaches with his balding head and he stares at you for... Hey, where do we put our stuff? Deception. <laughs> <laughs> nice. If I can... That's mine. And Five that, and six. That's oh, bricks. Grant, you got him. Yeah, your, your roll, base roll is by one. <laughs> All right. Um, so, uh, yeah. He's so caught off guard by your just your straightforwardness. Oh, yeah, just just go on downstairs, and he points you down the way, which is right over here. I'm oh. just gonna start walking that okay. way. Okay, cool. Um, yeah, you start walking. Does do you guys follow? Yes. 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 All right, yeah. you guys follow in coffins. The three people here are just sweating bullets because they're just training, and they look at you um, with a sense of envy as you guys just go down the <laughs> stairs. <laughs> so let's go ahead and put all this away. Okay. All right. Uh, did that one yet? Thankfully, that was Ooh, not going down the stairs. Yeah, All right. Can you see the map? Cool. So you guys approach and you come downstairs here. Uh, give me a perception check. Yeah, that's four. Nice. Four. <laughs> Eight. Eight. Uh, plus eight plus nine. nine total. No, eight. Eight, eight total. Uh, eight. Nineteen. Nineteen? Alright. Um, Bridget, with your keen eyes, you're able to pick out quite quickly that there are two statues right here. Much similar to the ones up above. You also notice that there's a door here, 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 and that there is a seemingly like a dark hallway down right over there. The air smells musty down here, um, obviously because there's no windows, ventilation, air is a little pungent. Um, you get the sense of like weeks old sweat wafting through. We don't notice any people? No, okay. you do not. I'm looking for the cloaks. Mm -hmm. So uh, which are the, the chamber that the five would be in? Um, or, well, the cadre. Well, the cadre. Cloaks, 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 cloaks. Yeah. There's a. This is a guard. Th three. We need this, the guard cloaks before we can get in. Right. So anyway, uh, I want to see what's down that dark <laughs> passage, right? The scent of must. <laughs> <laughs> Smells good. Interactive, full yeah. immersion. Immersive, yeah. So we have one, two, three, four passageways that we can explore? So there's three doors, yes, and then there's a hallway that seems right. dark. <coughs> so do we want to split up? Do we want to stay together? I think like a lot of the audience are screaming, so. don't split up. That's <laughs> <laughs> always a bad idea. <laughs> you don't know our audience, then. Yeah, yeah. yeah. split it up. Oh, split they want to see yeah. us be destroyed. Yeah. <laughs> well, in that we case, need to find I'm going to go faster. to the, the left door and see what's behind it. So the one right here? Uh, I'll go on this one right here. So I'm just gonna... Okay, door. as you open it, um, you hear snoring. <laughs> it's probably the room where they sent us, and I shut the door. And... Okay. Uh, what about what everyone else? I'll check the, the right door. The one right here? Yeah. Alright, as you open it, uh, there is some light and you notice that there is, there are, there are racks of weapons. Only weapons? Um, give me a perception check. 16 plus 5, so 21. 21. Um... Because of your high perception, you notice that all these weapons are better than everyone else's. Yes, please. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Why do you I waved to everybody in the doorway. Come Why? here. Because we're supposed to have yellow to identify ourselves. Okay. Hidden. Let's hit it. So it's what a, I'd like you flower. guys to do, as, as, uh, <laughs> as Ashura points out, wow, these weapons are amazing. They're yeah, better than what you guys yeah. have. Go ahead and read kicker sheets for yeah. all your weapons here. Um, okay. Write plus an additional one to your hit, and a plus one to your additional damage. So for you, that'd be plus nine, plus nine, plus nine, and then plus six, plus six, plus six. Uh, what if my attack is unarmed strike? You get nothing, uh, unless you want to get a monk weapon. Um, they don't have like gloves or anything in there? Uh, give me a d100 roll. I'll see if I can give you D100? some brass knuckles. Okay. I'll, give, I'll see if I can give you some brass knuckles. 
So we just add uh, plus one to our weapon. Plus one to hit and damage. Seventy two. Yeah. Seventy two. Oh, okay. Yeah, you find some uh, brass knuckles there. Yes. They're they're also magical. Yes. Okay. So it's plus one to hit and plus one to damage as well. That's sick. All right. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So now. Yes. I want to lock this door with my lock that I picked. You're gonna lock that door, the armory door. Yeah. After we. Oh, get okay. Out of it. Yeah. G give me a give me a d twenty. <laughs> That's a good idea. Nine plus your thieves tool is eight. Yes. Wow, 17. 17. Yeah. You take the lock you just got <laughs> and you put that on top of it. So now it's, there's two locks on it. Yeah. Hey. And they're not going to know which key is for it. <laughs> so, hey, that hey. might help later when yeah. we're getting attacked and they can't get weapons. Exactly. Hey, we're not running yeah. away. Exactly. <laughs> All right. So, uh, yes, what would you guys like to do? There's. Uh, I guess I'm going to look down the passage. Sure. Me. Yeah. Can you give me a perception? Yeah. Um, 15. 15 total? Yes. You look down the passageway and you notice that at the very far end there's a door and by that door there are um, rubbish bins and there are flying critters all around it and buzzing. Zzz, um, the faint smell of uh, fermenting garbage mm. just kind of tickles your nose from where you are. It might be the food preparation area Could down be. there. That's where I was going to We need to find where. Right by the garbage. The, <laughs> we need to find where the high level people stay, though. So. They're more likely to have the clothes. Yeah. Is that only the higher level people are going to be able to get into the Hey, tower? so are we it going down that way or not? It could be a trap. You know, you like, are we going down that way or not? A little bit of a trap. Is that the only option we've yeah. left? No, there's the, yeah, there's there's the door right here. Is this oh, an right. accurate like uh, representation of the? Well, we don't know what. We don't really know. You don't know because you haven't opened the door. But I feel like it could be like that way. <laughs> so what do you th what do you think, uh, Sam? Are we going down this way, or are we going I, in the big door? I think we should try the other door because this looks like the kitchen area with the food and flies. All right, get over here, guys. All We're right. gonna go through the big doors. <laughs> All right, uh, you open the doors. Can I get uh, perception checks? Perception checks from everybody. Twenty. Can you bring up? Not twenty. Oh, oh there is. Not seventeen. Um, Thirteen. This one. Yeah. All right. Not a one. So, sorry, can I get your numbers? 13. 13. 17, 20. 17, not 20. Regular 20. Regular 20. Okay. So, combined, you notice that there are three guards. And uh, Michael has just graciously put up the picture. You can see that these three guards have cadre cloaks on them. <gasps> and they're just eating where they're sitting. And you notice that right along here is a bunch of food as well. Um, can we whisper amongst each other? You can whisper, yeah. I'll, I'll just roll listen checks. Uh, I hope you know some good code. Have they noticed us yet? Yeah, they see you, and they're just they're just continuing to eat. Uh, if you want to f see how they feel, go ahead and roll me an insight check. Seventeen. Wow. Yeah. Eight. I have a good eight. Insight. Plus one. Sorry. 18. Sorry, Ashura. Fifteen. 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 Eighteen. <laughs> 18. Okay, uh, so uh, Sam, uh, Bridget, and Brick, the three of you, uh, you look at the guards that are just eating, right? And just kind of looking at you. Yeah. Uh, you get the sense that um, they're not bothered by you guys because who in their right mind would That's enter a Kadri barrack? Only Kadri would get okay. down this far. <laughs> so I'm just going to kind of casually stroll up and okay. as I'm passing behind one of them. I want to do a sneak attack, and I want to stab that <laughs> that dude in the throat. We need the cloaks. We got to keep it quiet. We though. need the cloaks, right? How many cloaks do There's we need? There's only three. You need four. Oh, well, I'd like right. to try and and, and stop, stop him, him from doing this because yeah. I have something I would like to try first. All right. <laughs> so, so, he might also he puts try a, stop a him. hand on my arm. I gotta I grab go, his other uh, shoulder and pull him back. Uh, I want to kill. I want to just kill him. Hey, uh. There's uh, like I go to jump in front of him. I have acrobatics. Really I go to jump it. in front They're of him. like brawling out in the beds. Like, who, who's, do we just ignore <laughs> it? Or are you, you guys look pretty competent. Do you guys go do that or? So you're, you're essentially telling that there's I'm, a brawl. I'm telling there's like a brawl you're in the, be the bed. Okay. Sure. Give me a deception check. 13. Oh man. <laughs> what, what's, what's yours? Uh, 18 plus, plus whatever. 18 plus. Deception. Uh, deception plus six. Yeah. <laughs> all right. They they all look at you like what? And they kind of all get up real slow and they walk right by you guys uh, 
through the door. Their cloaks are on them, right? Their cloaks are on them, yeah, but yeah. But now they're going to know we're lying. We should have just killed them. <laughs> <laughs> so they're now here at the door at this point. Uh, we'll, I like to wait till we're in a more advantageous position. <laughs> so do you want them to open the door or keep it closed? Uh, keep it keep it closed. Okay. I was hoping that one of them would... I'm sure. so tempted to, to try and right. steal one of the cloaks from the last guy goes through the door as the door closes, steals nah, closed. So, <laughs> so, let me, so that's your plan. I'd like you three to roll insight to understand Brick's plan. Uh, no. I'm gonna roll a different one because I'm not in the 20s. But I have a, 16. Ah, inside. Okay, 21. 21. Can I get insight? Oh, okay. Sam? 22. Okay. Um, insight? Yes. 23. Mm -hmm. Okay, all of you realize Brick's plan. So all of you can join in on a surprise okay, so round. What's your plan? Okay. So his plan is to kill them as they walk by, all together bunched up. Oh, cool. So uh, what we're going to do is I'd like all three of you to roll initiative, please. Oh, we, we are killing. All right. And this is 20? Okay. Yeah, 20 plus uh, whatever your initiative is One, last right one. over here. Plus five. Yeah. Okay, six. I, you have six total? No, I, I rolled a one. I rolled a one. I'm last. Okay. Uh-oh. Uh, so wait, so I, six? Ten. Yeah, bad juju. Ten. Ten. Twenty? Twenty. Okay. What'd you roll? Wait, that 20? 10. Yep. You, you that right doesn't do anything one. during initiative. Uh, yeah, thank God, because I just rolled a 1. <laughs> then that means Peter's going to go first. Forget that dice. Oh, that's this an one. interesting way to do it. Can they see that on the camera? Yes, they can. Cool. I'm going to go ahead and roll it right now for later. Well, oh, shit. Language. <laughs> family, family friendly! Family friendly! <laughs> family friendly. <laughs> All right, so you have a surprise round. So, Grant, you get to go first. What would you like to do? Uh, so... I guess draw my weapon and attack the leader, the one who's going out the door first. All right, cool. Uh, go ahead and roll me the, the attack. What will what, what, be using the rapier? Oh, uh, yeah, the rapier. Sure. You get advantage, too, because they're, they're, they're caught unaware. How loud are the dice roll? Everybody hear that? Four, a little more. Five plus. Uh, so it's plus four. So it's a nine. All right, so you draw your, your rapier out, and you in your rush to stab the leader, you kind of just poke a hole through the cloak, missing him entirely. We needed those. Uh, Bridget, it's your turn. Uh, okay, well, I want to attack the... I'm kind of also in the guy in the front, so... Okay, sure. Go ahead and roll the d20 twice, you have advantage. 17, wow. Okay. One more. See if you get a crit. 17, <laughs> twice. All right, I'd like you to go ahead and roll me a d8. Plus 3d6. So here, I'll give you 3d6 right here. I got plenty, yeah. Wow. 4, 5, 11, 14. He's instantly dead. One down. Okay. <laughs> so you take out like, your rapier? Or... Yeah, rapier. And All right. Just... With your rapier, you aim for this jugular and you just shoot upwards and just pokes through. <laughs> and he gags. Blood shooting out everywhere and you pull it back out. And not with, with, a nice, with a nice with a nice flourish. Close enough. It's close enough. All right. One's down. Uh, Callie. Um, I have a mace. <laughs> yes, you do have a mace. You also have a guiding bolt, which is a okay. magical attack. Okay. I didn't see that on. Yeah. It's a it's a cantrip. So would you like to do guiding bolt? Yeah, I think that Roll might me a D20, mace might be too close quarters. For sure. This. <laughs> Roll me a D twenty. Okay. And it's plus eight, I believe. Yes. For yeah. So what's your roll? Eight. Three. So eleven. So yes. you pray, and these magical <laughs> motes of power kind of like dance around the one you aimed at, missing him completely. No. All right, Ashira. <laughs> okay, what am I rolling? Are you are you, so uh, as a monk, you have you know flurry of blows. Okay. And you could also you could also choose as a bonus action to summon your four additional arms and then get three attacks. I can do that all at once in the same attack here? Yes. That. All right, so you spend two key points. Right from your back, four <sighs> astral arms shoot out. Um, can I have you go ahead? What? So are you going to do three attacks? <coughs> yeah. OK, roll. I have roll. brass knuckles on my actual hands, too. Yes, but that only your actual hand gets the bonus, the other, the other two. Okay. So go ahead and roll me d20 and roll twice for the first attack. This is your main hit. 16. See, 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 see if you crit. Let's see if you crit. You got advantage. Six, 19. 19. But not a crit, unfortunately. Uh, All right. Good. So let's go ahead and roll that two more times. This one? Yeah. Yeah, roll two, roll two d20s at the same time. 
Seven out of ten. Ten plus your attack uh, normally is plus five. That's going to be a hit. Okay. Roll me two more. D20s? Yep. This is for your third attack. Wow, 20, that's a crit. And a three. <clears throat> All right. Like that so you have three attacks. You, I, I'm going to give you that crit automatically. Uh, who do you want to crit? The one... Use two arm. Yes. <laughs> so two on one and then crit another. All right, cool. So for this one, I'd like you to go ahead. So it's two hits. Where's your damage for your fists? Dead. 26 plus six. So roll me 2d6. And then plus one for the actual physical yeah. one for that, yeah. Yeah, roll me, roll me 2d6. Okay. Yeah. Plus 11. Just wow. 5 plus 11, uh, 16. Let me see. All right. 18. Oh. No, don't worry. He's got okay. negatives. Oh, okay. He's <laughs> real. So with your first hit with the brass knuckles, <laughs> you, yeah, you catch him right in the jaw for... Let's say uh, eleven points of damage, and you fall through with your astral arm, uh, catching him on the other side of his jaw for uh, another plus five, again, six points. Of, no, for uh, six points of damage, which kills him. I'd like you to go ahead and roll me two d six. Or sorry, roll one d six. One roll one. We'll roll one. This is doubled. Two. Two plus Four. five, seven, fourteen. Let's see if you guys. <laughs> I am a badass. Yeah, that was, that was hard. <laughs> you, just, you just punch him in the throat because you're a terrible human being. You're just a terrible you human being. Stop breathing. Jog up. Stop All breathing. Three drop at this point. Okay. Oh, man. The encounter is over. <sighs> I hope nice. you're very proud of yourself. <laughs> I am. <laughs> we got three we cloaks. Gotta... One has a hole in it. <laughs> but we got three cloaks. <laughs> All right. Um, at this point, what would you guys like to do? Greg can have the one with Grab the hole in pokes. it. Grab those pokes. Alright, Greg can pokes. have the one with the hole in it. Sure. <laughs> you did it. <laughs> right, so I guess I'll put on the, the cloak with the hole in it. <laughs> sure. Uh, what else is in this room? Uh, just doors? food. Just food, yeah. Are we yeah. hungry? So they doesn't get, get food. Food. You can eat if you like. It's fine. <laughs> yeah, because I'm, yeah, I, I did just use my astral arm, so I need to replace my strength and you know, energy. I think we should try to hide the bodies. Maybe under the table. Mm. You want me to just punch them flat? Let's, the kitchen's right over here. Let's just throw them in like... Oh, that's a good idea. What if there's someone in the kitchen? Kill them. Kill them too. Where's the stairs in relation to the people training? Where's the stairs? They're right here. Oh. In okay. relation to the people training? They're right above you. Floor. Yeah, they're downstairs. Like and within 20 feet? Sleeping. No, definitely there's not. There's people sleeping okay. in the other room. I should have locked that. that door. <laughs> yeah, the people oh, yeah. sleeping door. Well, All right. In there. Um, at this point, can I have you guys roll perception check? Four plus four. four. One. Uh, Fifteen. Fourteen. Okay. Five total. Nine. Nine. My drunken Shaolin Kung Fu is all of it. There should be a couple more. <laughs> oh no. Did they not get sent? Hello, are we still alive? <laughs> <laughs> I'm just like, yeah, no, yeah, yeah, we're good. As long as you get red there. Oh, yeah. this is fine. Here, I'll, I'll pull it on my phone. Um, so, that what was, was your perception, powerful. Bridget? Yeah, I got lucky at the crew, Nine. but still, like, ah. Yeah. <laughs> Super arms. Five. Fifteen. Fifteen. Fourteen. <clears throat> How many times can you say that? Sam and Ashura, <laughs> key back um, you can see oh, a womanly figure right here by the door. <laughs> Uh-oh. For now. Um, both of you can see that she coughs for your attention, and then she waves you over. Oh. Um, you okay. can see she's heavily armored, though, okay. and has a cadre cloak. Okay. Should we kill her? Oh. No, I'm just kidding. She, she, do the, do we're, the we're wearing magic our cloaks right now, right? Uh, yeah. Wait, which of us? Grant has one in the hole. I have one. I have one. So maybe you're fighting I'm for it. So <laughs> none, only one person has the cloak. So who's going to have the other two cloaks? No, I, I took them out. I'm putting a cloak on. Okay. Yeah. Oh, I want a cloak. Sorry. Okay, <laughs> yeah, the only one without a cloak. <laughs> uh, so, let's go talk to this lady and. Yeah, get I go over, cloak. letting Kelly go so, first. This is who you see standing behind you because you know because you're the, the underling officer. You're the you're the oh, underling. Damn. I've got the cloak, which means okay. I'm supposed to be higher rank. So. Oh, okay. Yeah. Uh -huh. All right. Sure. So as you enter, are you entering? Yes. 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 Yeah. Oh, oh. We're very trusting. You're very trusting. <laughs> Not trusting, no, let's just ask, let's trying ask her to act the, the, the part. phrase. What's the We're phrase? Do you know the journey oh. or what's the? But she's okay. With them. You stare okay. and you see, and um, she throws a bag at you guys. Who wants to roll a deck save? She's got good decks. 
I got plus. Uh, we both have plus sure. five. Yeah. Okay. Five, uh, five plus eight. That's good enough. Thirteen. You catch okay. the bag. Oh. And it's pretty heavy. Um, you almost drop it on your foot. Um, and you can see that she's wearing yellow. Nice. And she says, "Is your journey far?" We know the way. Yeah. All right. Um, she lets you know uh, that she doesn't have. Much. She just stares at you guys. Take that. It's going to help you on your mission. I don't have too much time to explain. She goes towards the bed and she begins to kind of pull, pull it out of the way. Um, because it's so obvious, all you can see and notice that there is a kind of small hole that um, leads to an escape tunnel. She quickly points to it and tells you guys, go in quickly. Um, Do you know where we can get another cloak? We need one more. I provide you with four. Oh! <laughs> In the bag. Including oh, without a okay. hole. <laughs> Sorry, okay. Um, yeah, perception checks. Ashura, as you ask questions... Uh, 13. 23. <clears throat> uh, 25. <laughs> the three of you, <laughs> and not Brick, you hear um, chatter, noises. Hey, there's some bodies here. What's happening? Mm. You can hear uh -oh. that other people are coming. Quickly, go. There's... Brick, come on, let's go. <laughs> All right. <laughs> yeah. As you go, yeah. yeah. As you go in, she kind of whispers, shouts to you, listen, the five are not who they seem. Be very careful when you go next on your mission. They are incredibly dangerous. Go, quickly now. Um, you're, you have enough time to ask one quick question before you get sent off. As she goes towards the door, uh, sword in hand, uh, ready to kind of stop them from pursuing you. Do the five secretly ever leave the tower looking as if there's someone else? I think that's what she was hinting at. I want confirmation. <laughs> you seem far too wise <laughs> for someone who drinks. <laughs> <laughs> and she gives you a wink, acknowledging something. Okay. And okay. she dashes off, and you guys hear the sounds of swords clanging against each other, yeah, uh, the sounds of screaming dying guards, <laughs> and you're able to escape. Okay. Cool. We escape. Okay, how dark is in this little tunnel we just crawled into? Um, it's lightly lit with with special moss that leads the way. Mm -hmm. Okay, so they know the way. What color is the moss? <laughs> are they yellow? Know the way. Are they yellow? Do we know the way? <laughs> we know the way. Neon green. <laughs> the memes are real. Oh, I forgot to do something. <laughs> Who wants to hear voices? In my head. <laughs> okay. Sorry, cool. I should have I should give that to you guys earlier. That's my fault. I'm I hear the voice is better when I drink. The secret card. The secret card. Okay. It's a voice inside your head. <laughs> okay. All right. While well, that is happening, I hear a voice. Yes, we're good. You're telling me um, this. Do you guys <laughs> want to open the bag? Oh, I want to open yeah. the bag because so, I need a cloak. Okay. Inside. <laughs> she, she gave you the cloak. You're good. You find that in four cloaks, as well as... Oh, do we need to check if our cloaks are any different than those? No, they're exactly the same. Okay. Yeah. Well, Grant should probably swap out, because... <laughs> Grant, you must swap out. Okay, I'll swap out. <laughs> <laughs> All right. We need to make sure there's no questions about our identity. Oh, okay. So the cloak is crafted and enchanted to protect us. Okay. Ooh. How so? All right. Uh, well, definitely get rid of the ones we had. They didn't work too well. Yeah, that one had a hole in it. <laughs> if you fall while wearing it, you descend 60 feet per round and take no damage from falling. You gain a plus one to AC and plus one to dexterity saving throw. Granted access to the Tower of the Five. We knew we needed no, so to guys, we just killed. They really sucked using their cloaks. Okay. So we just bashed their skulls in. <laughs> Pretty much. All right. Uh, so you also, if someone wants to write this down, um, you guys also have iron bands of binding. It's essentially a metal rubber band ball. Um, it's something you use to capture people if you need to. So if you want to write anywhere in your character sheet, uh, you also have an immovable rod. You have a mantle of spell resistance. Hold on, hold on. Iron okay. bands of bonding. Yep. Uh, immovable rod. What's that Wait, one? Say again? Immovable rod. Oh, okay. Um, mantle of spell resistance, ring of spell turning, uh, 
Hold on, hold on. Ring a spell turning? Yes. Essentially, a, a ring that will protect you against a spell. What's the deal? Do you all have this, or are we dividing this up? You have to divide it up. Oh. Okay. There are four potions of greater healing. So each of us, you get a potion, obviously. Yeah. And there is a scroll that will identify everything, letting you know all the magical effects of everything you've just have gotten. Yes. That's convenient. Yep. Isn't it? <laughs> just in case there's no spellcaster in the group, you just have a scroll. I figured we're going to give it a... Oh. Well, it sounds like something to give to Callie, but if she can already identify things, then... Yeah, yeah, but using it, it will identify, essentially. We have gelatinous dust. When combined with water, it will grow to a five-foot cube and inch towards someone. <laughs> we could, no, we could use that to block people chasing us. I mean, yeah, mean, uh, it could come in handy if we just grab some water and mix up some Jello, and then. Just, uh, uh, <laughs> I think the most important items are you all have the cloaks, okay? Yeah. Uh, don't put them on. You can put them on now; it's fine. Uh, but I thought, yeah, we want to use it to blend in. Not yeah, yeah, that, that'll be later on. Um, <coughs> I think you guys have the goggles of truth, which will show you. Uh, Eight thirty. The truth, is, yeah. Well, there's yeah. a deflection there's blade one. that can add <laughs> plus two to your AC. Um, a shield. Does anyone want a shield? I'll take it. You know, honestly, who's got the lowest <laughs> armor class are worried about, you know, being able to defend themselves? Yeah. yeah. I could, I mean, like... Does anyone want I have a mace, though. Shield's kind of I don't know. Like, right? The blade's pretty so cool. What? The alertness, you get a, uh, advantage, advantage on initiative. Advantage on initiative rolls. Yeah, you know, yeah, you didn't go so well. I'm <laughs> drinking, so. <coughs> you got the dust. Kali got the shield. Yeah. What, what about Voice the my head was only for part one for the for the yes. Yes. Oh, okay. I have a mace. There will be a couple but more times the voice will speak to you. This gives a plus okay. one sure bonus to attack I and plus two to the bottle. <laughs> okay. Uh -huh. Eighteen. <coughs> okay. I want to see the candy cane roll. The so candy cane is the nap 20. <laughs> I got these goggles. So uh, almost. Yeah. Once I, I, think part. I think those will be useful to see who okay. the five actually So. Oh, true. Yeah. Who wants to wear it? I do. Okay. <laughs> As you guys go down, you head into the Warrens, which is essentially the underground area of the, the drifting city. Essentially, these are tunnels that were dug in to create homes for the people. Because living on the surface with all the high winds is incredibly dangerous. Um, you guys arrive yeah, at a tavern yeah, awesome. yeah. called the Bright and the Bold, which is neither. Um, <laughs> you know, as you enter... Michael, more sound effects. <laughs> sounds of tavern, yeah. sounds oh, of wind. Got the wind. Oh, there's the bats. And the tunnel. Yeah. Um, you guys, okay. as a group, as a lawless, know that right here in this back room is where you will leave dead drops to get messages. Mm -hmm. uh, you guys will know to leave a message there that your mission was a success. You all have cloaks. Who wants to go inside to leave a message? I don't know what message to leave off the top of my head. Uh, you just say that you have the cloaks and you're ready for the next part whenever it is. Uh, I can, I'll do that. Okay, cool. So... Sam, well, you go in. by the door. Okay. Yeah. Okay, so, probably. You write a message in chalk on a slate base of a lantern hanging in the alley. Mm -hmm. um, I forgot to divide up our other stuff, too. So the move of the oh, oh. It is now yeah, lit, letting down. people know yeah. that you left a message. Oh. 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 He needs and it. you're just coming yeah. back. <laughs> All right. Um, as Sam is coming back, can I get a perception check from everybody? I mean, four. Eight. Ah, oh, that was one off the candy cane. <laughs> 18. 21. 18, 21. Oh, perception, uh, 13. 13. Brick. Just a little Just a little Plus okay. I have the goggles, no, 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 so I can see so. in magical darkness. Yeah. I mean, I'm good at seeing You're stuff. You're good at seeing stuff. All I'm right. only plus one more, so it's five. Five, okay. So, uh, Brick, you're too distracted, just sipping on a, on a beer from the local <laughs> proprietor. Um, the three of you are, uh, you're, all four of you are gathered at the table. The With three of you. Stolen gold. Stole, stolen yeah. gold. Um, <laughs> I don't know how much I got now. <laughs> do you want to count in front of all these shifty, strange no. people? No. <laughs> all right. I'll check it later. They were earlier. Damn it. <laughs> um, you, uh, the three of you, uh, except for Brick, notice a, um, a shifty looking halfling. And he approaches your table with a direct, Hey, guys, <laughs> what you doing here at this time? Just enjoying the drink? <laughs> oh, right. <laughs> Did you find some nice coin? Where? What do you mean? He kind of just looks at you. I mean, 
You're buying some of the finest beer in the establishment. <laughs> I'm just always drunk. That's the truth, so it's not a deception check. <laughs> <laughs> yes. <laughs> all right, all right. Do you mind if I join you at your table? We're kind of a private group right now. <laughs> kind of what, sorry? We're kind of a private group right now. <sighs> okay, so are you, you going to try to persuade him to leave? No, nah, who are you? <laughs> Oh, my name's Cave. Cave Cobbletongue. Nice to meet ya. Nah, I'm not shaking your hand yet. I don't know you. What do you want, Cave? I just, I just check in and say hi, hello, how are you doing, is all? Where, where are you from? Hi, how you doing? I'm from over There's there. The door. It like and he points the, towards the bar the, where he came from. Like a voodoo guy. <laughs> can we, uh, can I, I do a perception I check on him? Uh, like, what's, what's his intent? Oh, uh, insight. Insight. Insight, insight. Oh. yeah. yeah. Kidding, 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 kidding. That, oh, one off again. A uh, insight. Yeah. Thirteen. He's too smooth for you for some reason. Mm. Damn my Does drunk anyone else want to roll insight? Yeah. Damn my drunkenness. Well, haven't noticed yet, right? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, twenty. So twenty. All together. Crit? Oh. No. All together. Okay. Um, Sam, you know he's just trying to get some information. Probably someone's looking to know some things. And you get the sense that this guy is just trying to get whatever he can from your group mm -hmm. and sell it. So he's not someone to be trusted. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. We kind of refigure that. Yeah. Do, you want, do you want to tell him to leave? Yeah. You're going to tell him? I'm, I'm still going off of the fact that I can't perceive anything from him. So I was like, you know what? We're good, dude. Have a good one. Would you like to persuade I'm, I'm not very persuasive. You're not so. very persuasive. You can intimidate. <laughs> if intimidate, it's better. If you don't have business here... You should be no. on your way. <laughs> okay, so persuasion. How do I have no intimidation as a monk? Persuasion. Let's go. Fifteen. That nice. Nice. No, I don't have any bonus, but... So fifteen? Yeah. He just, he just walks away. All right, man. Don't, don't mean to bother you all. And he walks back to the bar and just continues to drink. What um, was that about? <laughs> <laughs> um, at this point, uh, you notice that there seems to be some light flickering inside right over here. And uh, can you can you guys roll a perception check? Yeah. Uh, over the sounds of the tower. Eleven perception. Eleven, 11 16. total. Sixteen. 16. One. Ah. Oh. Eight. Uh, no, plus twelve. Plus twelve. Twelve. Okay. Um, Sam. Oh, fire. Flickering flames. Flickering flames. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Sam, you notice that um, there's some sounds of struggling happening back here. Uh -oh. I rolled higher than her. What do I say? Did you? Um, yeah, it sounds. I might. Roll was 11, so plus the 5, yeah, 16. 16, and you had a 16 as well? Uh, no, total 11. 11, okay, sorry. Yeah. So, sorry. Ashura notices what's happening, and you hear the sounds of, like, metal into flesh. You can hear that. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Do, do you, want, you guys want to investigate? Yes. Check it out. Okay, so we should probably get out of here, because honestly, this is going to get too risky. We need well, we, to be low profile. Okay. We need to know well, what the next part of our mission is, right? Yeah. As you enter, you see that there is a person over here. You can't really tell who it is. Do you approach? You can definitely see that there is a knife in uh, their belly. Mm -hmm. I stumble over drunkenly. I exaggerate my drunkenness, so I'm trying to, you know, like, I'm trying to reverse into me. I'm trying to be unassuming. Yes, I can heal him. Okay. So you approach, and you stare, okay. and you look, and you notice that this is a, uh, da, 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 da. I double check this. Uh, you see a gnome. He's lying down there. Um, is and he alive? Is that a medicine check? Yes. Uh, you notice that his wound is very blackened, almost like necrotic. Um, 11 plus uh, one. for medicine, 12. Yeah. You assume he's poisoned. I have, I can do cure wounds. Uh, I can grab do, you, Rick, do you let uh, Sam know that the, the oh, gnome I, is poisoned? Yeah. That is a poisoned wound right there. <laughs> that is really bad. Do you want to give a medicine check, uh, Sam? Yeah. 15 total. 15 total? Do we see um, yellow? It's a very, do we see yellow? Tell. He's wearing yellow. Oh, right, right there. Right. Yeah. yeah. Like, um, you you can right. tell that this poison is uncurable for, uh, for no. everyone in this group. 
I think I'm going to cure this poison right here. <laughs> sure. Are you casting cure poison? I'm going to attempt to cast Lester, Lesser Restoration. Sure. I'm going to roll the 20. Great, 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 great. 19. 19. Ooh. He's dying. Oh, you're dying. Got 20. With his last breath. Distraction. <laughs> the square. <coughs> Tomorrow. I know the way. <coughs> well, what's the way? Okay. Okay, he's gonna say right. <laughs> somebody's gonna cause a distraction in, in the, the square, square. Yeah. tomorrow. Hey, tomorrow, so we, we need, need, tomorrow. We need tomorrow. Like to cast speak with the dead. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, do you really have that? We don't Let's, need to. Oh. Yeah, sure. Go ahead. Why not? We get more details. Roll. <laughs> no, no, you just cast it. Okay. Now there's gnomes right in front of you, floating, ghost like. It hurts. It hurts. Aww. Suck it up, And you can see that the ghost has the wound right there. You're so dead. Dead. Like, dead. Gosh, that's Who's hard. causing the distraction in the square? <laughs> in what time? Other oh, lawless. In the morning. Oh, that's two okay. questions. You got three more. Hmm. What else do you need to ask? <laughs> Don't ask him Whatever that. you want. Is there any street. secret passage oh, no, into the tower? Don't ask him that. Front door only. Well, that's why we have the cloak. How many ways is there? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay, I can't say that. <laughs> <laughs> What about something about the five? Like, how can or we or identify the them? Or yeah. you can identify them by their magic power. <laughs> <laughs> and it's gone. Oh. No. And with that, we're gonna stop here for part one. So we'll, we'll give. What's uh, your life? Five minute <laughs> <Sorry>. break. <laughs> <laughs> what did you have for breakfast? <laughs> <laughs> Was it good? Sure it's coming out of his stomach. <laughs> <laughs> Was it tasty? Terrible. It looks kind of. No problem. So let's take a quick break. Okay. Yeah, like rest. We're resting up. This will be a long rest. Okay. So you get back your spells and get back any HP. Key. That, that, yeah, you get back your keys. Yes. Okay. Okay. I can do multi armor nice. again. Yes. Yeah. That thing is. Bashing some skulls. Got to be well rested for the <laughs> Punch some heads. adventure ahead. That's a sick move, you know. You can just especially when I get a freaking twice. That was nice. <laughs> if only I knew that poison wasn't curable. I would have tried something else. <laughs> The Speak of the Dead was inspired. Mm. Seriously. Then we asked a bunch of goofy ass questions, but it's funny as so. hell. Well, I feel like we're gonna get where we need to go, right? Yeah, eventually. Or die trying. <laughs> Give me the candy cane. I have not seen the candy cane rolled yet. The candy cane is the twenty. Uh, <coughs> it has the two lines. You guys ready for part two? Yeah. Let's do it. Okay. <laughs> so uh, you guys arrive. Oh, 20. Sorry. 20. That, that one, I like it. Ah. Yes. All right. That was good. After successfully retrieving the cloaks, the party meet meets just below the Tower of the Five. Uh, there they can see a massive crowd gathered uh, okay. together. Some willingly, some brought by force by Kadri soldiers to witness the ritual. Oh. So it's almost like they want a big old crowd to see this. Most definitely. Intimidation. Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. Twice. Oh, 19. Yeah. Okay, so, uh, so we, we people we are talking, it's crowds. Uh, you can see there's too. a bunch of cadre soldiers, right? People are just like milling about. Uh, no one's allowed to leave. Again, pushed back inside by the cadre. There's a lot are of we, Are we starting this encounter with cloaks on, or are we using the crowd? Um, insight, please. You can do whatever you want. Two. You can do whatever you want. Do you want to roll it? I, I, yes. I look to the rest of my group for guidance. 18 plus 8. 18 plus 8. Yeah. You remember that you shouldn't wear cloaks because someone might question you. I look you. to the rest of my group yeah, yeah. to question you. put on the cloaks guidance. just before you enter the tower. Yeah. I'm clueless. Okay. We, we don't want to be. I don't see anybody else putting on cloaks. We don't want anyone asking questions. I don't see anybody putting on cloaks. I don't put on my cloaks. I, I, yeah. All right. That was so bad. That was so bad. Oh, it's just funny though. <laughs> it was right there. So oh, after a period of time, a shout draws everyone's attention to the balcony in the front of the tower. Walking out solely, the five exit the tower and take position at the edge of the balcony, several stories up. So they're up here essentially. Okay. But are they really? Identically alive? dressed in crimson robes with their faces obscured, the five stand menacingly looking over the crowd. Okay. Let's see if we can find that picture. That group one, that one. Beep, that's a good goggles one. Goggles of yeah, truth. Essentially, like that. Yeah, can I whisper something to the rest of my group? Just to them? Yeah, yeah, sure. What do you say? I'm gonna roll listen check. 
<laughs> what? That, well, I see now. <laughs> I'm gonna roll this in check, so what do you say? <laughs> okay, I got 11, what do I do to hide that? No, just no, whisper, no, whispering. Gotta, it's, it's, don't worry, just... Okay. I don't think those are the five. I think the five are among us. Okay. As you say that, um, can I get perception checks from everybody? Including me? Wow! Yeah, 20 with yeah, the goggles of truth! Yeah. I see everything. 14. 14. 17 perception. Okay. I want to look for yeah, illusions as well. And okay, so the three of you notice the five, and uh, Draga, the leader, stands in front and begins to speak. <coughs> um, Bridget, with your goggles on, you can see the truth, and you can see that Draga's by himself. Mm. Oh, so there's up there? four other ones. Yes. Somewhere. Yeah, that, that's and the I see one. them that's in the square. And <laughs> just drag it by himself is essentially that. No, that's not it. Oh, not this guy. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Sorry, it's the wrong one. It was the one I showed you earlier. That's okay. the group essentially. Yeah. So. Um, yeah, yeah. And you, you notice, and there's something really awkward and strange about him as you stare. There's something really off-putting. Can I have you roll a wisdom save? Because you, you you have such perfect vision no, of him. What about the crowd around us? They're just like looking up. Everybody? Yeah, look, listening to you speak. And the guards are looking up and watching the crowd. Okay, like there's nobody uh, in the crowd looking okay. at the crowd. No, so no. it's a 17. Okay. It's a 17? Okay, cool. Oh, it's a plus one. Do the voices plus in my two. head say anything? Not yet. Okay. Not yet. Um, you feel a shiver down your spine, Bridget, but... <sighs> You <laughs> currently you're, you have a strong resolve and you don't quake, you don't flee, you don't scream. The monsters are attacking me. Um, you're fine. Your resolve is very, very good. Iron resolve. Uh, Drago looks down and addresses the crowd. Um, what you guys hear is different from what Bridget hears. You guys hear, Look upon your saviors. We are those that saved you from the sure death below. But Bridget, you hear, It is on this glorious anniversary. Of the raising that something is weird about Draga. And before Draga can finish the sen finish his sentence, there's a loud explosion coming from the left. And the guards look, and the five also look as well. You can see Draga kind of motion with his hands, and some of the cadre begin to leave to investigate. The people are beginning to panic and push and shove. Them. To the right, there's another explosion. The five look to each other and convene. You just see Drago just turn around by this himself. Looks really strange and awkward, Bridget. This is it. Yeah. Guards go, the and the five fly away <coughs> with their uh, dark sky, which is a, uh, their wizard people. Their apprentices. The, uh, the, uh, the people begin to scream as well as more and more explosions around begin to erupt, Heads leaving the Heads square. Leaving the square completely empty. At this point, no, I don't, want, you, I don't want to run towards the tower with just us. That would be too obvious. As the people are starting to scream and flee all over the place, in the madness, I want to run to the tower at the same time. Right. With the club, put the cloaks on. We gotta, we gotta put our cloaks on. Too, it's right? completely right. empty, safe for you we guys. To, we, yeah, we need to go now. So Wait, you no, put on the cloaks. I, no, I, I don't. No, I don't want to head. I don't want to run to the base of the tower, but it's just us. Okay, so there's no. Run to the tower. Everybody's run. Everyone, everyone, everyone run. Everyone. Everyone yeah. run. When there's a rain right where I want to disguise that. Sure. Nine, 16. 16. Is that, is that a, uh, that's a 13. 14. 14. 14. Plus. Yeah. 14. All of you can see that everyone's completely gone. It's pretty much bare empty as you dash forward as everyone flees. We couldn't there's, run when they're fleeing? Yeah. So yeah, you, yeah, you ran you as ran. they fled. So now it's oh, empty. Okay. You're at the door. Gotcha. There's nobody around you. Put okay, on, now's the chance to put on our cloaks. Now okay. we gotta put on our cloaks. Do you have the door? Yes. With our cloaks on first, yes. <laughs> yes, cloaks. Okay, yes. you guys quickly put on your cloaks. And as you put them on and you enter through the door, you feel a jolt of magic course over your bodies. Had you not had the cloaks on, you would have been uh, Kentucky Fried Vaporized. Chicken, essentially. Yeah. <laughs> Vaporized. <laughs> now, do you need to die over here for... Give me one second as I figure this out. Okay. So you guys came from here. So uh, all the characters will be right here. Perception check? Yes, perception <laughs> check, please. Always. <laughs> 20. Oh, oh, got the cringe. Oh, she got the Christmas tree. <laughs> seven. <laughs> okay, so seven. 22. 22. <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> Not, uh, yeah, great. 
Okay, seven. So inside you notice that there is a table with chains and surgical instruments. You notice that there's a lot of blood here as well. You notice to the side that there are two doors and a stairway that leads upwards. You notice that inside these cages, there are five creatures. Uh, one of them you guys know very well uh, as a glabber. It is something that has evolved or devolved deep within the mountains. It is something that knows no pain. Uh, beside it is something you've never seen before. It looks like a humanoid with red um, lava in its mouth. So I'm going to show the glabber. I have really good right animal handling. So first, glabber. So audience, that's the glabber right there. The second thing they see is do, do this one right here. Okay. Uh, the third creature you see in the cage is a small furry thing with four eyes and big goofy feet. And it looks something like this. Um, the fourth one is a quadruped. You've never seen it before in your entire lives. It's got a long snout and sharp teeth and a very long bushy tail. The fifth one beside it is a massive creature that stands maybe eight feet tall with a sharp mouth um, and huge, huge arms uh, that ends in uh, razor sharp claws. And the most unnerving thing about this creature is that the head turns in a complete 360 direction, both ways, as it looks at all of you. Okay. <laughs> I you know all of you, I have really good animal handling. Do we want to <laughs> try and animals? use, do we want to try and use any of these before Can we open any cages? Us? Before we open any cages, do we want to try and at least see if any of these will seem like they'll work with us or anything. Um, they might be yeah. worthy um, allies later. I can do an Useful. insight Sam, check for that. With your crit, you notice that one of these cages is open. Which one would you like open? <laughs> oh, your choice? The lock is off. <laughs> My okay. choice? It's Wait. your choice. Uh, Not... Can we cliff notes on the, the five uh, again? I choose I the one that's furry. <laughs> the furry. The furry one. All right. Okay. This is the one I choose. Number three, the third one in the middle. <laughs> is the, the big fangs the most and the bushy tail. He's very all. cute. No, he's got, he's, he's got big goofy feet and four cute eyes. Oh, oh. cute. Yeah. yeah. yeah that, here, that let can, me show you that what he looks like. That can be misleading. That can be misleading. I got yeah. I got a picture from my Drew. <laughs> okay, can I immediately try and do oh, animal handling to try and like, you know. He looks like this. Uh -huh. Can I immediately try and do animal handling Aww. to control this? That's what I drew. That's that's totally different. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah you, you, you can try to approach and do animal <coughs> handling. Yeah, yeah. Give me a, give me a. I have plus five, so fingers crossed. Yeah. 16. Sixteen. So what are you trying to do exactly? Just get it to stay where it is. Okay. Stay so away. from where you are, you you're like, hey buddy, just just calm down. Kind of like uh, uh what's his name, Chris. From Chris Pratt. Chris Pratt. Oh, 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 yeah, I'm, I'm, Jurassic, I'm Jurassic Worlding. Why like, the heck hold, did I think Hold, Hanson? hold, hold. <laughs> I don't no, know. No, Chris Pratt. Hold, Chris, like, hold. Uh, yeah. All right. Yeah, you try to do that, and as you do so, can I get an insight check? Crap. <laughs> family no, friendly. Family friendly. I'd say it's the worst. Fifteen insight. Uh, Twenty. Not natural, but. Everyone roll for initiative. Oh. Uh -oh. <laughs> Going back to, I'm going candy cane, candy cane. 17. Candy cane. Where's my candy cane? Sorry, 17 is from Grant. Where's my candy so cane? Grant's right here. 17. What'd you roll, Peter? 13. 13. What'd you roll? 8. But is there a plus for this? Yeah, yeah. It's <laughs> plus 2, so you have a 10. Okay. I got more candy cane. Okay. How am I last again? <laughs> the Don't same worry. Order. It worked well before. I think. Right. All right, cool. All right, Grant, um, it jumps out of the cage. And it just lands right in front of um, of, of uh, Ashura. So it's like right here. It's not going to attack yet because you guys were aware of it. So I'm going to cast sleep. Okay, when it jumps out, can I at least call, like, hey, this is not a friendly creature. Like, you know, this is not good. You can say that. I'll let you say that. Okay, you cast sleep. Yeah, based right. on my you know, an animal one handling. Second. Cause my animal handling should have been able to do it. I couldn't. This was your hand. moment for animal handling. <laughs> I don't know. Yeah, I don't know what this thing is gonna do, but it's not good. Five this is not good. Or, or sorry, five. Sleep. Ah. Okay. Go to sleep. Yeah. Go ahead and roll me seventy-eight, and if it, you're successful, 
Is that is that discriminant or indiscriminate? <laughs> Still on 78. Lowest current HP. Ah. Okay. What's your total We're HP? We're all max HP, yeah. You're at 60. You're at 45. You're at 45. Cool. Two. two between two of us. Two. So eight total. Okay. Uh, we need some ten. noises. We need some animal noises, huh? Sure. Yeah. <laughs> Eighteen. <laughs> yeah, no, it tries to look cute. That makes sense. <laughs> Twenty-one. Beware the little furry four-eyed kid. 28. 28 total? Yeah. Alright, so you try to cast sleep, and um, you guys, so uh, Sam and Ashura with the lowest HP feel a little sleepy, but you stay on top of your on toes. So unfortunately for you, Grant, it does not work. Would you like to run away, though? Never. You, have, you have a move action to back away. Uh... I have a bonus action, right? Last you do time. have a bonus action. What would you like to do? I'd like to inspire Peter's action. Oh, okay. Yeah, he gets a plus. Yeah, so you have a D8 in addition to your rolls. So when you roll... Uh, D20 plus D8. Except for damage, you can add that to your roll. All right, it's okay. your turn. What would you like to do? Add a, a 1D... You can add a D8 to your roll after you roll. Nice. Attack! Um, <laughs> right, like... I mean, this thing hasn't, like, it, are we sure it's threatening? Yeah. I feel so bad trying to, to kill it. It's furry and cute. That's how they get you. I can you. try the iron bands of binding and just... Like, yeah, <laughs> you definitely can. But is it worth... Yeah, yeah let's throw it. Let's, get, let's try and put All it right. back in its cage. You throw it at it. He's, he's trapped. <laughs> he's now wrapped in, like, this giant oh, yeah. iron rubber band ball. <laughs> and you can see only his eyes. He goes... <laughs> All right, that's over. <laughs> All right, well, I don't know if we, Should we sort of save that. Go, but. go up the stairs. No, honestly, like, as the animal person, I'm saying, okay, that wasn't the one to go with because honestly, but it I, was a humane thing to do. No, no, you know? like, like, no. Uh, I'm no asking you guys. Dead. Let's go. Do we want to use one of the other four as our ally to bring with us? To, We're like, trying to save didn't the world. Didn't they all look here? extremely yeah. scary? Right. Yes, and they yeah, also look like they also scary. look like they've been experimented on. Yeah. Can we booby trap the gates and like create no, havoc? If I want to try it? and okay without opening the cages. Can I do animal handling of on course. the rest of the four? Yeah, to see if I can control them. Sure, go right ahead. He said you can try. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> you know, if I can control them, I want to use them as an yeah, ally. No, yeah, no. Uh, please go ahead. Okay, cage without really opening the cage first. Yeah, yeah. So cage number one first. The the glabber. Okay, go ahead. <laughs> I'm just gonna roll all four and say one, two, three, four. Okay, yeah. Go run out of time. Now. Okay, first one is six. Nine. Sorry, nine. Plus five. Well, this I saw this one come out first, so that's uh, 20. Oh, did it? Oh, sure, yeah. yeah. I went like this. So, I was going to literally, okay, I was going to literally see so you, 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 pris you try to crisp pry it. <coughs> Unfortunately, the glabber's not an animal. Okay, so, oh, you wanted to waste my 20, you bastard. I said the <laughs> nine first. <laughs> but I saw this first from my angle. I right, literally just pointed them all at the same time. Yeah, I didn't want it to What's this one? I can't see it for now. Seven. 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 Uh, so you go Plus to the, five the humanoid with like that red mouth. He tries to spit lava at you. Dick safe. <laughs> Shit. Yeah. <laughs> family, friendly, family, friendly. <laughs> Ten plus dex. Uh, five, fifteen. You're able to dodge it as this like okay, so thing melts stone. Though. Eighteen. Um, this Plus creature. Five. Yeah. So twenty-three. This creature seems to be passive Case but, three. but okay. it, it's very distrusting of you it's very distrusting of you it's calmed down a little bit but still very distrusting you can tell that okay. much and four uh the, that the thing sh that thing shakes the cage back and forth so much so that it begins to kind of tip over towards you okay deck safe <laughs> dangerous <laughs> So how many of them Six, are in the animals? Uh, 11. 11. It falls really slowly and you're able to jump away as it kind of just crashes over. Okay. But the, the creature is still locked inside. Okay. I don't think that's the way to go. Okay. What was creature number three again in you the line? You, you tied it up. Four then. No, I did yeah. four rolls. So. Yeah, yeah. So you did one, two, four, five. What was the one that's not sure of me? Not trusting? Number four. The, the quadruped. Sharp fangs, bushy tail? Yes. <laughs> Can we transport this other creature in our 
bands of binding? Can we take it with us? If you want, sure. We'd have to oh, so, you know, like, toss it in the room, unleash it, close the yeah. door, listen to the screams. I'm going to take it. <laughs> All right, you take it. No, I like that. Yeah, toss it in the room, unbind it, close the door, just listen to the screams. Yeah, <laughs> right? Cool. All right. Nice. Like well, we have, a, we have half an hour left, guys. <laughs> okay. No, do you guys do you want to grab? Put the bag over I think we're doing one for done here. These things, yeah. We don't I think we can train this fourth one. <laughs> it's going to take you a month. Yeah. Come on. Never mind. <laughs> <laughs> up we go. We Let's get a spell. Go up, right. up we go. So you up we go. Upstairs. Yeah. Upstairs. Yeah. All right. Leave, leave the rest. All right. You guys go up the stairs. Okay. It's gonna take you a month. All right, let's move on. <laughs> All right, we stop. We they take can a stay month. in the case for a month. <laughs> one month. Like, oh, later. you didn't trust me. Oh, we'll we 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 just, just, just hang together. out there. Yeah. Just hang out there and train. Yeah, that's yeah. Yeah. At that point, they're all desperate to get Training out. Training montage. So let's go. It's yeah. our party. All right. Wow, this, 80s theme music. This power is cool. Perception. 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 Yeah. Ten to key. That's the ten. Uh, Oops. Twelve. Fifteen total. Fifteen total. Okay. Twelve total. Twelve. Nine. Fifteen. Fifteen. Uh, inside, you notice that there is a nasty stack of bones right here. There is a metal Quite torture. Nasty. Uh, skulls, bones, oh, okay. rotting bodies. Uh, over here is a torture table <coughs> uh, with an individual who may or may not be dead. Uh, over here as well, uh, you can see that there, these are essentially cells with dead, dying people. Yeah, look at that. Look at all them bones. Yeah, all the, uh, the, That's gross. Okay. Family yeah. friendly. Yeah, yeah. stuff. <laughs> all right, so we didn't notice any, any, anything else? There. Uh, you know, also, that there's a stack of barrels as well right beside you. I'm at like no people or anything? No, no. I'm going to do a medicine check on the Sure, body. give me a medicine check. Don't have time. Two plus eight, ten. Ten? You can, uh, you can see that he's breathing and you assume he's dead. Uh. That's a joke. What? <laughs> That's, a joke. <laughs> That's a joke. Um, uh, you can see he's breathing, but he doesn't look too good. Okay. I want to invest. He's beyond, the, he's the beyond the all the your spells. Is that the guy on the table? That's the guy on the table, yeah. I want to investigate the room. See if you investigate like... the room, okay. Uh, that's a 16. That's a 16. Maybe. So where where do you want to go first? Uh, just any, Is there anything within visible eyesight that... Maybe the bear? Mm -hmm. Um... Invisible, so you look at like, yeah, just show me where you're going first. You're going there, yeah, yeah dead bodies, dead bodies, dead bodies, dead bodies, dead bodies. Looking on around the okay. table. As soon as you get here, I need a perception check. Uh oh. Just him or everybody? Just him. Just him. Well, I'm, I'm 13. Well. Yeah, yeah, no, just just him okay. because of the situation. Okay. 13. 13? Yeah. Okay. Uh, nothing. Yeah, you're fine. Okay. I think, yeah. <laughs> that is so close. <laughs> <laughs> that is so I want to look at the barrel. Hey, buddy, you're that's, not you're not doing. Here. I'm, I'm going to talk to the guy on the table. Since Are you focusing on the table? Uh, yeah. Um, out from behind, three of you. Roll perception. Uh, crap. We you, need to go upstairs. We you, need to force you to not. Nine. Seventeen. Heck yes. Nineteen. Uh, plus five. Twenty-two. Nineteen. Twenty-two. Nine. Nine. No matter what, all three of you get to see it except for Bridget. Uh, you notice the sickly eyes. looking elf uh -huh. jump oh, out right. and pretty much. Uh, sickly? Sickly. Okay. Very sickly. He's very. Like skin and bones or how so? I will. Twisted medicine. and mutated by magic. Okay. Okay. <clears throat> mm -hmm. Well, look at the tower. He's got right. advantage. Dobby. Nine. Eight. Nine. Da, 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 nine. Uh, does a 17 hit you? It goes to the defender in my when I play, so you're safe. So he tries to take a swipe with this very wicked looking dagger against you, but it doesn't hit. Uh, it kind of glances against your armor that you have. Uh, everyone roll for initiative. My deflection, uh, mode, perhaps. 23. 10. Should just 13. 13, 4. I go last and I wreck, so. <laughs> All right, sorry, 13, four, wow. Thanks. <laughs> Brick? Uh, 20. 20. Oh. All right. Uh, da, 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 da. Did he get an extra attack for that? 17. 17. He should get an extra Wait. attack for that. It's not really. an extra, it's just 19 plus one. Grant, please. Shh, lie. I'm gonna cast a lie. Charm, charm person. He got a charm nat, person? He got okay. a nat 20. I got advantage on that. <sighs> Changed your role. <laughs> <laughs> And what's the DC? Uh, it's uh, I don't know. seven. Uh, 
Okay. Uh, 16. Okay. Uh, so you attempt to cast Charm against him, mm-hmm. and it does not seem to work at all. Well, that's unfortunate. I will uh, in- inspire... You have the Ring of Alertness. You have it. Callie. Advantage on initiative. Goals. Yeah, bonus action. Mm-hmm. Fortunately, he doesn't remember that. Hey, drunk. Aw. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> the bottle's empty. Callie, you get the I'm rolls. trying anyway. Wow, my rolls are not. I get what? I'm a drunken monk. When I you need do to alcohol to project myself. Thing, you can add that after you roll. Okay. Oh. <laughs> Astral projection. Mm-hmm. All right, so oh. this, this <laughs> creature attacks you. Once again, uh, Bridget, unfortunately, just seems to miss all the time. It's terrible. I need, to, I need to throw this dice out. <coughs> Does it go to dice jail? Yeah, I it goes to the that. dice bag. Callie did it. All right, Bridget, it's your turn. I don't, I don't know if I want to fight this elf. Let's just... I don't Do you want to turn around? He's want, kind of starting no, to No, that, that would be an opportunity check. Uh, no, 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 we I need can, to go I up. Look, yeah, dodge, look, right? you, No, but you can look at him. It's not... Moving is attack opportunity. Just like going. Wait, he came from. Oh, oh yeah, yeah. He's, he's, right, he's right beside you, so you look. Oh, okay. Give me a perception check, uh, Bridget. Twenty. Wow. <laughs> so you do know that the gloves um, pierce beyond magic, and you get to see this creature's true form, right? Oh yeah. Yeah, he's super handsome. He's just stunning. Yeah. Yeah. Like. Yeah. Because the goggles show you his true form before the magic, so he's just this handsome elf, just trying to. Stab you. <laughs> well, you I see something completely different. <laughs> I have the goggles of truth. Yeah, I'm yeah, and you see his either. true form yeah. as a very beautiful elf. Well, now I feel like killing him more. I guess. <laughs> like I thought, I felt kind of bad for this good. little elf, but now he's like some Screw this sneaky, handsome. Yeah, yeah. Uh, do you do you want to stab him? Hemsworth, brother. Wow, nineteen. Okay. Yeah, that's gonna be a hit. Let's... So go ahead, and you because he's not flanked. And he's already attacked. No sneak attack. So it's going to be a 1d8 plus 6. Plus uh, 3. Wow. Nine. So that's going to be 9 points of damage. Yeah, Plus I take... get a bonus damage for my, my blade here. You want to use that one? Okay. So you do 10 points of damage with your deflection blade. Just like stabbing at him. Yeah. Yeah. He seems pretty pretty offended by that. Uh, you, I guess you enjoy looking at his handsome grimace. <laughs> <laughs> ah, take that, you handsome F. <laughs> All right. Sam. <laughs> I can bless Josh to buff him? All right, yeah, you bless him. Okay. I have my key back, so I can pull up my other arms, but we're not to the five yet, so I'm actually wanting to save my key. All right, so, um, you've been blessed now. Do you want to move up to attack him? Is he, you think he's one of the five? <laughs> he's super handsome. Is, okay. is, no, like, he's been be experimented five? on by the five, I think. So that, was his, that was his fake form. His oh, mini D- real form D- is. Oh, have you handsome. told us that he actually is handsome? He's handsome, guys! <laughs> I don't understand. You don't believe He looks like a Hemsworth! From, from Bridget. <laughs> Do I hear anything in my voice is in my head? No. I need to drink more. <laughs> As a bonus action, you can choose to drink. Not right now. <laughs> Uh, oh, yeah, do you want to punch? I haven't blessed, so yeah, I'll punch. All right, so do you want to do a flurry of blows? That's three hits. No. No. That's one key. key, right? That's, that's yeah. one key, yeah. yeah. All right, go ahead and roll d d20. Plus d4? Plus a d4, okay. At the, the same blood? time? No, no, so roll first, and if you feel it's too low, you can sacrifice the d4 to roll uh, in addition. So it's 15, 15 plus... Wait, what am I adding? It's right here. Your, your knuckle dusters. I thought there was only one, or no, I thought there was only you're, you're, physical. You're doing your normal punch, yeah. Oh, because I'm not doing the, the arms, you, you, yeah. Yeah, you got your brass so, knuckles on. So, uh, plus eight to the hit, so 23. Yeah, that's going to hit. So go ahead and roll damage, oh. the d6 plus six. Plus five. Oh, six plus one, yeah. Yeah. Okay. Oh, what's six? Oh, the bone die, hell yeah. Five. Five, wow. Oh, yeah. So you plus, punch plus one, so 11 six. points of damage right into his ribs. <coughs> cool. All right. So it's back to Brick. Okay. He has no reaction? He doesn't slow him down, he doesn't like, like, uh, anything? You get the sense he's pretty durable. He's mm, a very... Okay. This guy could be a five. Okay. Right? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I could be all the way out there. Uh. <laughs> I'm gonna try charm up again. Can, all right. There's, there's no, like... I get advantage. Yeah, yeah. Okay. So. Uh, 
Four. Four. Oh. Why do you get two rolls? Advantage. He has advantage. He's I had 15, us. so you're kind yep. of fucked. So you try to cat charm him again, but he seems to resist. Do you want to move yeah. away or just um, stay there? I'll move to just outside. Do, do, of, you, want, do oh. you want to try to flank? Because you can go like this, and that way you can help give advantage to uh, okay. to Ashura. All right, cool. With that, uh, it's my turn. Oh. <laughs> uh, this person, this. this this elf is just really obsessed with you, Bridget. Oh, he crits. Oh, oh, no. What? <laughs> I was bound over all at one point. All right, cool. That's so he tiring. takes this wicked dagger and uh, what? Da, 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 da. Ah, here we go. What this elf? One, man. two, and that's a D. I hit him pretty hard, but he's still standing. I don't know what to tell you. Four, four, three. Oh, that's not good. This guy's powerful. Eleven plus three. It's 14. You take 28 points of damage as he sticks his dagger. 28? Yeah. Crit. Oh. Out of 60? Okay. Okay. So just right down to to do a, the heavy damage roll? No, it needs to be 30. Okay. Oh, All right. It's rough 32. Though. Bridget, it's your turn. Still rough. Left? Yeah, it's, it's my turn? Yeah. Oh, I'm mad. I'm mad at this, this dude. Yeah, we need to lay into him. I'm also, that really hurt. I get the feeling this is actually one of the five. That's what I'm saying. I, I don't see if I have any. Uh, uh, if you'd like, you can roll a history check on your turn to see if he's one of the five. That would be my action, though? No, I will. Uh, oh. Okay. It'll just be a harder DC as not as a non action. Okay. <laughs> All right. Well, let Definitely me just. That die try right and, there. <laughs> uh, attack him. Sweet. Ooh. <laughs> Four. You, you do have inspiration. Uh, yeah, let's do an inspiration. Because right now it's at a 10. So, oh, you so, so if you roll something hot. That's seven. enough to hit. Oh, great. That's enough to hit. So you have awesome. 17. Yeah, go ahead and roll a, D, a D8 plus 6. Uh, D8 plus 6. Mm -hmm. so, oh, that was a 1. Mm. Okay. So I get so, one bonus. So you, take, so you stab him again with your, with your new Bye. sword of flexion, 7 points of damage. It cuts in and you feel like you're, you're, you're grating on, on rib bone, but it kind of comes out slow. This guy is, has some pretty, pretty hardened skin. Mm. Mm. All right. Sam. Yeah. All right. It's too handsome. I'm, I think I better heal Bridget. So you want to walk <laughs> up to the good idea? Yeah, one, yeah I'm going to do three, the... Four, five. Is this the best yeah. one? Cure wounds? Sure. Yeah. Cure yeah. wounds will be... Uh, what does it say? 1d8 uh, plus 1d8 slash SL. For a spell level. Okay. So at level 1, she's going to be a d8. Okay. Are they still in the place with all the bones Plus and five. stuff? Five. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Because this little elf has been attacking They're wiggling. The worms inside you deal 12 them. points oh. of damage. Oh, nice. All right. All right. Ashura, it's your turn. Okay. I'm going to pull up my extra arms. I'm going to lay in this. All right. You get two, so you spend two key points as a bonus action. You've got them. You can spend another key point to essentially do uh, five attacks if you need to. Do I have to do it before I start rolling? You, you can do your first three, and then later cool. I'll let you okay. spend it. So what do I roll for the first so three? So he's flanked. Go ahead and roll roll 2d20s first for your first hit. Not that one. You touched it. This is unlucky now. <laughs> then take that one, then. This one. one. Advantage. 14 and 11. That's going to hit, so roll roll six. Both? No, no. So that's advantage. Oh, okay. Gotcha. You get advantage. Okay, you get advantage. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Roll again. That's the first hit. At, at advantage. So mm -hmm. take the yellow one. Yeah. The, take, or take a different one. I'm throw it picking out. one. Hurry up! <laughs> Seven, Seven and four. Ooh, that's a miss, unfortunately. You get one more hit with your uh, with your four extra arms. D20? It's, it's an advantage, yeah. So two one. d20s, two d20s. <laughs> Abandoned. Okay, so you got two hits. Go ahead and roll damage. Two d, uh, one d6 and one d... Uh, so, yeah, two d6, two d6, sorry. And you can use that's your d4. Seven it. plus eleven is eighteen points of damage. You go one, two. You miss on the second, but your third one actually hits, and he seems to be coughing up blood this time, but he's not down yet. Do you want to use a key point for two additional hits? Yes. All right. So you're down to two key points. So go ahead and roll uh, two d two d twenties for the first of the attacks. Where's the there it is. Here's your Christmas die. Yep. Yeah. 16, 12. That's going to be hit. One more. One? So both of them. One more hit. One more attack at an advantage. 17. 17. Those are both going to hit, so go ahead and roll uh, 2d6. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> 2d6. 
two bone die. Plus 11, 6, 17. Bam! Bam! He goes down to his knees, he sways, and you just go one more for good measure, and he goes down. He's gone. Finish him! <sighs> Search the okay. body. Yeah. You find a, a dagger that deals 3d4 <coughs> points of damage. <laughs> Would you, you like it? What do you all uh, can have it? You want it? I took the deflection blade. Okay, so. can we do like reception check? Does this seem like is this something? We know it's already. Give me a history check. You, you can look at him. Give me a history check. Candy cane, candy cane, candy cane. 18. Okay. History? Uh, he's He's a member of the Dark Sky. Oh. He's not one of the five. Not one of the five. Okay. Is this uh, the That's no, their um, magical? Yeah, I know. Uh, uh, there are there are a few noteworthy people in that um, that order, though. Is he's, this he's, the? He he is the uh, grand torturer. Highest. He's the grand torturer. Oh, he's one of the top. The, he's a what, top three? member. Yes. Top three. Yeah. 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 Now okay. at this point, would you guys like to leave? Yeah. You go upstairs. Oh yeah, we're going. We gotta get going. All right. So you go upstairs. That's not mine. <laughs> and here you are. The very top. Very top? No, I'm kidding. Already? <laughs> it's like, wait a minute. I'm, I'm, already I'm, screw there. I'm screwed with you guys. Come on. <laughs> so here, uh, you can see that there is a very <laughs> large bed, a table, and there are two rooms and the stairs in front of you. What would you guys like to do? Search the place. Upstairs. No, let's, let's just upstairs. Keep going. All right. You guys just go upstairs, yeah. <laughs> skipping this entire place. Um, as you do so, could be oh. a bad move, maybe, but... You notice, as you get up to the very top, you arrive and see before you the fire. A glowing blue crystal. And around it are floating shards. It's the fire. I oh, drunk really say as I trip up the stairs. Oh, did we not get that? I thought I sent that to you. Okay. The, I think the, it's the, the fire. The top of the mountain there? Yeah. No, 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 no. It's the fire. Here, I'll pull it up. Yeah, we see the fire and get the hell out of here. Whoa. How much does a healing potion do? D8? Uh, it's going to do... Potion of healing? I believe a greater healing potion is 44 plus 4. 44 so plus 4. That's what it looks like. Did you chug that in the last room while we were walking? So you up? see this yeah, essentially swarming on you. Uh, around it are mountain chunks from the time the spell was cast mm. that float and levitate. Um, it glows with great power. And it feels pleasant. Well, that's nice. Uh, 11. Hey, you guys, this is uh, a fire. We should grab this to get the hell out of here. Nothing bad about feeling pleasant. We should grab this to get the hell out of here. No dark omen there. can't grab it. Oh. I just healed for 15. Gonna, <coughs> good rolls. That's okay. going to cause the world to crash. I'm almost healed up. Now we need to steal the fire. Yes. Let's steal it. This is our mission. I'm good at stealing. This is our mission. So, uh, let's see. Uh, do Wait, are we supposed to steal it? I thought we were supposed to steal it. Related things. Steal right, right, I'm going to look at the uh, okay. thing with the goggles of truth, the, see if I can detect any... Give me a perception check. Uh, can I also do that? Because I bring of alertness. No. Can I re-roll that? Uh, bring alertness is for only for initiative Wait, wait, but I... So that was uh, Why haven't I been using that? Eight. Because you haven't remembered. <laughs> oh, no. Yeah, that's an eight. But do I get a finger. roll for my... Yeah. Well, lesson? did you did you give another bardic inspiration? Oh, I only get... Oh, you have Cali one. Okay. Oh, okay. You were using it one time to hit, so oh, it's gone now. All right. Uh, I have an eight. Yeah, you look at it. It looks really cool. It's floating there. I don't see any illusions? No, no illusions. Nothing like that. Hmm. Okay. Seems real? Yeah, it seems very real. Yes, it seems like it's it. All right. At this point, uh, do you, what do you guys do? I'll use Mage Hand to grab it. Give me a <laughs> d20 roll. What do we have? So you Pink cast Mage solid. Hand and a floating, what color would you like it? Blue. A blue hand grabs blue at it and tries to pull, but it does not move. It does not budge. OK, that means it's heavy. So. Uh, give me an insight check before you say that. Okay, what's below the flame? 17. Um, it's not because of that. It's because the, its magic is too strong to be moved by a mage hand. Okay. Mm. What's below it? Nothing. You can you could go underneath it and reach out for it. So we're all standing here. Where is it in... in Guys, I think it's like, like right, right here. Put your hands yeah. together and all reach and try and grab them at the same time. Okay. Guardians of the Galaxy. I feel like that's going to burn our hands. Together we are the guardians. You won't feel it. <laughs> Do we have one of those magic? You want to just grab it? Though? Yes. Yeah. All right. As soon as you grab it, you're fully healed. Yes. And I need a perception check. Key? No. Why not? Just, just healing. Can I have, can I have your, <laughs> but you haven't taken any damage, so you're fine. I roll, yeah. I want roll my key back. Please. Roll perception. 
Blood die. Go. Four. Perception. Nine. It's not that special. Just floating around you. Uh, but you notice as you move and push it and hold on to it, if you let go, it stays there. So essentially what you're doing is you have to move it by it's force. It's locked in place. Yes, locked in place, essentially. Um, and as you move, move it, power, so how do you move as it? you move it, everyone else except for uh, Ashura, I need you to roll me an uh, acrobatics check. You're fine. Please Bridget's please cool. Yeah, please don't burn. 12. Call it 12. 16. Yeah, so okay. you're, you're able to like hold yourself in place as you feel the drifting city shift <gasps> as Ashura moves it around. <laughs> Try We're supposed to. to steal this thing? Uh, at this point, how do we right, steal take the it? city down. Do I hear voices yeah, in my head? You get a voice in your head. We're gonna destroy the world if we if we move it. Who who wants it? Who? I don't know. You. Okay. All right. So. Um, da, 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 da. Okay. As you have it in your hand. I know I'm kind of drunk, but I'm touching it. Like we need to get this fire off the damn city. We just need to get uh, it off the city. It's the only way to do this. We need to get this fire off the city. But we're also gonna move the entire. We city. need to move the city. We need to move the fire off the city. All right. As you're talking, uh, you can hear a hissing voice. What do you think you will accomplish? Oh no! And at this point, you can see Draga by himself. Um, Actually, him? What you perceive. Uh, perception check? Yeah, give me a perception check. Candy cane, candy cane, candy cane! 10. Okay. 15. 15? 18. One job, Grant. Put images crit, on the crit, thing. Crit, I put crit, them on. Crit, crit, crit. Thirteen. So thirteen. Nobody crit. Plus you one. Can, one. Plus one. Okay. So you can see that he's armored and ready to go. Um, Bridget, with your goggles on, you roll thirteen. Yes. Yeah. You can see that um, as he lifts his hands up, you see that it's skeletal mm -hmm. and brimming with energy. Mm -hmm. Roll for initiative. <laughs> I put my ring on. Your ring is on. Ooh. Two plus Ooh. two. Two, four. Okay. I got 19. You got a 19. Kai's got a 19. 12. 12. Ring on. Yeah, roll twice. For initiative. 20. Crit. Oh, now I get the crit. Really? <laughs> well, it's very important for you to go first. <coughs> yeah. Let's bash his heads in. That's a few times that red guy, the red guy, yeah. All, all. Are there like a bunch of comments that are screaming, why didn't you do this? Like, <laughs> yeah, a few here and there. A few here and there. Probably. Search under the bed. <laughs> so, Kelly, what was your roll? Sorry. 19. 19. Okay. Yeah. All right. Big baddie. Yeah, big bad evil guy. All right, sure, you're going first. Um, I'm going to represent him by this sparkly D4. Hi, Josh. You and your comments. I respond to the audience. What do you want? <laughs> Hi. <laughs> I know they're listening. I know they're saying things. I like to respond to what they're saying. I listen to you out there in TV land. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I'm sure. What are you doing? You're going first. You have it in. <laughs> All right. Well, um, you, 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 you still have the arms. They last quite some time. Cool. Oh. So do you want to do you want to dash and then punch? Smash face in. Sure. I'll, I'll let you get right mm. here. That's perfect. Cool. Okay. So uh, he hasn't acted yet. Bar so you get advantage. Go ahead. We need some How many? Uh, are you spending well, a key some... point? I thought I already had the arms. You have the arms, but are you going to do flurry of blows essentially? I haven't spent another to do that. Yes. So you do. You have three He's right now. Ring of spell. Training. Three's good. All right. Go ahead. You have advantage. Go uh, ahead. Roll two d twenties. Yeah. We'll give it to you. Sure. I don't know. Christmas cane. Christmas cane. Cane 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 cane. Sixteen and six. Sixteen and six. Sixteen plus your six, I believe. Yes. Wait for what? For your for your melee attack is plus five plus six. That's twenty two. Yeah. You hit. Go ahead. Roll again for your second hit. Two d twenties. Two d twenties. We're, we're just seeing what you hit with first. 11 and 3. You miss on that second hit with your astral arms. Okay. Third hit. So 2d20s. Not that one. Hit. 10 and 11. You miss as well. Do you want to use Fury of Blows? Yes. All right. So you spend another key point. You're down to one left. 
Go ahead and roll 2d20s to see if your fourth hit hits. <laughs> this is like battle royale. <laughs> That's going to hit. That's okay. going to hit. Go ahead and roll another 2d20s for your last hit. <laughs> 19 and 3. <sighs> So that's going to hit. Okay. So you have three hits. Okay. Go ahead and roll me 3d6. What's lucky? What's lucky? What's lucky? Cool. Christmas die. Christmas die. Do it. Five, three, and three. Five, three, and three. Okay. So that's going to be 11 plus six is 17 plus five is 22 plus uh, another six is 28. One, two, Second hit misses, third hit misses, the last two connect. <laughs> and as you hit, you feel the sound of bones cracking. As I the, should. Beneath the weight of your fists. <sighs> at the end of your turn, he points a finger at you, Ashura. Oh no. Ashura has the mantle of spell resistance, though, I believe. Uh... I believe I no, do. No, you have, <laughs> you have the normal cloak. <laughs> I do have the cloak. Five. Ah, <sighs> uh, he misses. Like right. would. <laughs> I'm we going did to activate up. my shield. <sighs> yeah. Someone yeah. has to take it. And come yeah. around. I'm going to try to... I just figured I was going to yeah, rush in first person. Anyway, Who got a spell yeah. attack? I want to be yeah. there with the shield. Sure. Uh, it seems to have some... some I do have acrobatics to get out of the way. Jonas does, <laughs> Absorption abilities. Okay. I used all good. my key though. And I guess yeah. I hit him well, with my mage. Damage. Sure, it's a, so it's a plus six. Boss, right? Go ahead and roll. <laughs> a d20, d20, d20. to, to okay. see if you hit him. Yeah. Ten. Ten. Plus six. You swing, but nothing seems to happen. Oh, okay. <sighs> At the end of your turn. Yeah. <clears throat> no, no, no. Yeah, no, okay. Uh, he casts, he turns his face towards you uh, to frighten you. I, I need you to roll me a wisdom save. So plus the wisdom up here. Yeah. Uh, what is it? 11 plus 8, 19. 19. You resist against it. Nice. Okay. Good, good, good. And then now it's his turn. Uh, he begins to... Mm -hmm. Double checking all this. Ah, he begins to heal. <laughs> yep. There's a ring of spell turning. Oh, okay. There. Take a pause. No, 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 just just on this camera. There's still okay. live stream. Still live stream. All right, cool. All right. Just wait, yeah, just wait for it. the. Did you know, you just had to okay. figure out who's got it. I took the binding bands. So you guys get the other stuff. <laughs> all right. We do have that. And we bound, and we've oh, had don't, a don't, uh, yes, no, okay. forgotten about it. Yeah, so, okay. Sam, we have a this stuff he too. tries to touch you with a single finger. Yeah. I have a shield. Uh, that's <laughs> not enough. Uh, it touches you. A finger? A single finger. But it touches the shield. <laughs> uh, <laughs> it'll it'll, it'll absorb some of it. Yeah, it'll absorb <laughs> okay, some okay. of it. Eight, Two, nine, one, six. Uh, Two, nine. So, it absorbs nine points of damage. Okay. okay. And I need you to roll me a 20. constitution save. That's not good. Five. Uh, five plus six. one. You're paralyzed no! for ten rounds. <gasps> what? So we're going to have to literally drag her with us. Ten rounds. The hell is this crap? Bridget, the All voice right. urges you again. The same message. Can I hear it again? <laughs> <laughs> Do we hear it? No, no only only. He doesn't even us about it. Yeah. <laughs> Does anyone hear any voices? <laughs> All right, I'm gonna. While I, this guy's distracted, hey, I'm gonna sneak up. I yell by. back. <laughs> Grab yeah, the <laughs> fire. Grab the fire. Take so it away. So currently, I sure has it. So you can go up to him and grab it for your entire turn. Wait, I have the fire. You have it in your hand. I thought I touched it and it healed me, and that was it. Oh, you uh, you never said you let go. Ah. <sighs> really? Yeah. <laughs> Since it's his turn, I can't throw it to him, can I? No, but he can Ooh. grab it from you and then move downstairs. Okay. Oh, so I'm taking the ball and running with it? Yeah. Do you want to grab, do that? You no, know, take the fire. Take it. Take it away. It's the only way. Uh, okay. All right. 
So as you do so, da, 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 da. oh, I see grabs that. Can it's I perform idea. the feed of acrobatics and get in the it's way not of your the turn. opponent? It's not your ah, turn, unfortunately. Okay. You're able to get to down here. You have the fire, Run, and you go. fully heal. You're you're back to full health. Um. All right. Well, um, thanks, guys. At the end of your turn, <laughs> Callie, go. Nice. Go. go. At you the end of go. your turn, he looks towards Ashura, and he will attempt a finger touch. Do I need to roll anything? It hits you. I need says to roll. who? Says me. I didn't even roll. I need to roll a Constitution save. Roll what? Constitution. So con. What by? D twenty. Candy cane, candy cane, candy cane, you little punk. That is not a candy cane, it's a six. You're paralyzed for ten rounds, <sighs> one minute. You take 13 points of damage. Brick. Um, <laughs> I'd like to cast Lester Restoration on Cali. Sure. Uh, is it touch? Or is it range? Oh, touch. Yeah, you you'll have to rush up. Oh. Or do you want to? Okay, okay. I need to know my action economy. Yeah. What 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 is? What you is have a bonus this? action. You have a standard action, and you have a move action. Okay, so I, I'm gonna move. Okay, you're gonna move towards Callie. Okay. Yeah. You move towards I Sam. Move. Right, right there. Okay. Right there. And who has the orb right now? Okay. I do. I grabbed it. Are you I was Bridget has it. No. No. Just them two. Just them two. <laughs> I'd like to uh, then less lesser restoration. Sure. Um, Oh! On her. And then, as my bonus action, I like to mix the gel into my water flask and throw it at the, yes. the guy. <laughs> oh, no. Mm, unfortunately, Not. because... Is Lesser Restoration bonus, or is it standard? I believe it's a standard cost. Yes, slow him down. Action? Instantaneous. Yeah. Just action? Uh -huh. Okay, so you would not be able to do that. Okay, so I have, what, a bonus action left? You have a bonus action. You can yell stuff. Um, if you have, like, a special bonus spell cantrip, you could use it. I'll in inspire Callie. Okay, <laughs> so you have a D8, extra D8. All right, at the end of your turn, Brick, um, he's going to move up one, which does not provoke attacks of opportunity, and he's going to attempt to hit you with his finger as well. That's going to hit... Guys, you, you, you need a more ranged approach here. Uh, you take 11 points of damage. I need a constitution save. Me? Yes. <laughs> You're paralyzed for one minute as well. All right. Is Kali still paralyzed? No, no. no I've been recovering. I sure I can't enough. do anything. Kali, it is your turn. Uh, <laughs> they're both paralyzed now. Yeah. But I could... Block him any way you can. Or, or try to restore break. I guess. <laughs> <laughs> Who can do more damage? Are you gonna cut? But I'm out of key. You've got one more key, and you still have your arms. Can we kill this thing though? I don't think we can. We're trying to scare. Callie, people. would you like to roll a perception check? Yeah, if I keep hitting him, yeah. I keep stalling him. I mean, you're paralyzed. You can't do anything. I'm not paralyzed. Not you. I was talking oh. him. He's oh, talking okay. about hitting him. Can't hit him. We can't 15. move. Fifteen. Um, you speak. noticed, as the fire is taken away, um, that Draga, when he looked like he was being healthy, is look, it looks like he's no longer as healthy ah. as the fire is taken away. More skeletal. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I don't know. <laughs> it's okay, it's okay. So, Sam, what would you like to do? Would you like to move away, cast a spell... I want to restore Brick. All right, yeah, less so. restoration. Unfortunately for um, Draga, he doesn't have an attack opportunity, so no, no counter. Would you like to move away, or stay where you are? Oh no, I want to move where. Okay, you can move yeah. towards the stairs then. Yeah. Or you're gonna move right there. Okay, that's fine. Well, so I can still. Yeah, block. yeah, Touch yeah. Okay, cool. Yeah, block. All right, with that, mine. Um, he, Draga. Is going to frozen very last. Uh, I can't do that anymore. Ah, you guys are a pain. And he begins to cast a spell. Uh, because both of you are not paralyzed, you are allowed attacks opportunity to try to disrupt this spell. Um, go ahead. Pound his head in, please. 
Ooh. Four. <sighs> Callie, please roll. Better. D20. D20 plus six. Please roll better. 18. Yes. 18. Plus so that's six, a hit. Go ahead and roll damage. I believe it's a D8 or D6 for a mace. Uh, for my mace, six. Where? Squared. It's right oh, here. Oh, right. Okay. Five. Five. Okay, nice. cool. So you hit him for 11 points of damage, just kind of trying to disrupt his spell casting. Five. It's a nine. He's I'm able to five. concentrate, unfortunately. <laughs> and he casts a very disruptive spell that begins to come down and hit the mountain, and it begins to shake. Uh, I'd like, well, Josh, unfortunately for you, Ashura, because you're paralyzed, you automatically fail yeah. as rocks begin to fall from the ceiling. Uh, I need deck saves from both of you, and I need a deck save as well from you, Bridget. I take damage. Safe. You automatically take damage, yes. Eight plus two. Eight ten. plus two. Okay, ten. Okay, so you're taking full damage. Uh, you're <sighs> taking zero because you're a rogue and you have evasion, and you're taking half. Six. Oh, That's I more. a lot of die. That's a lot of die. Seven, eight. That's a lot more die. Nine, ten. This is gonna hurt. It's gonna hurt a lot. Yeah. Six. Oh, 12, oh my god. Eighteen. Twenty-four. Thirty. Yeah, I gotta. Uh, I gotta crit save. I'm gonna. Thirty-six. Uh, forty-four. You gotta take forty-four points of damage. I'm KO'd. Oh, okay. So I take half? You take half, yes. Okay. Um, my shield takes seven of that. Your shield takes uh, 11 of that because you took what? nine before. Oh, so, okay. yeah. Yeah, I'm dead. 30. Okay. You're yeah. you're unconscious. Right. You're just down here like that. Okay. Bridget. Okay. You want to just run out? No. As my bonus action, I'm going to release our little creature friend back up into You're going to throw the ball up the here. Chamber, right? Sure. Throw it up. Okay. <laughs> Um, I'm gonna put right here. So I'm gonna throw that up, and then I'm going to run over to this window. Is that a window? No, that that's a room you have not gone through yet. You don't oh. know what's in there. Are there any windows? No. Hmm. Oh, actually, sorry. There's a balcony that's uh, right over here. You can jump out of. Okay. How can I, how tall is it? Uh, about fifty feet. Yes. I have a rope that's fifty feet long. You also have the cloak. Well, you have the cloak. Huh? The cloak lets you jump safely. Oh, it does? Yeah. Yes, you and know you that can much. Fall okay. damage for six well, I want to jump over the balcony with All my right, you wood. jump out. As you jump out, uh, because you're, uh, because the voice is gone for Ashura, um, you get this message. I'd like you to roll me an insight check. What's that? Oh, okay. We'll show the camera. I've rolled this four, like, you do 80% have, of the time. Do you, I think, don't you have Bardic or no? Huh? No, sorry. Uh, Sam has Bardic, unfortunately. Huh? Huh? What do you think you should do? As you hear that voice. Well, how uh, how far am I from the edge of the uh, city? You could, in this single turn, if you choose to run, mm -hmm. you could probably jump off, yes, safely. Okay. Well, can you do so? Um, yes. All right. You're holding on to fire. You're running. You're just going through it. You can see and hear a lot of explosions around the city. You can see Kadri and Dark Sky fighting with other lawless with their yells flashing as you approach the edge you jump out and lightning begins to surround you as you descend through the purple clouds shooting all around you okay uh -oh. they hit you uh -oh. for a lot of damage but because you're holding on to the fire right it restores you yes unfortunately the air is thin here mm. i need a constitution save uh 14. you pass out holding on to the fire <laughs> At the end of Bridget's turn, the mountain itself collapses on top of our of our friends over here. What? <laughs> I think we're. I need going. I need a I need a deck save from both of you. <gasps> Ten. Eleven. <laughs> a lot of damage as you perish beneath. No. The rubble. Am okay. I killed outright? <laughs> You're killed outright, yes. Uh, sorry, guys. Who's left? <laughs> Just Bridget. My Bridget, the Fall monster off. thief. Falling unconscious Please. with the orb? Yes. But still just holding it tightly. You wake up. Yes. And you expect 
to see a hellish world, the one that the gods ripped apart. But it's very strange. The sky is blue. There are strange green things. They seem soft. The green little cat whiskers below you, as you put your hands through it, is also very soft. You can see that there's a fire and someone beside it. And you can see this scaly, massive individual look and speak to you. And you can hear his voice. And it's the same voice that spoke to you, giving you the message. You've done well. Welcome to the world. Do, 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 do. Remember us. <laughs> and with that, you guys have successfully completed <laughs> success. Rebels of the Drifting City. Yay. We did it! Thanks for sacrificing your lives, guys. I forget. <laughs> Josh disappeared into the eons of time like a thief. <laughs> so if any of the people in the Walking audience have questions, the cat whispers, whispers. I'm more than welcome to answer some of them. If you, some people seem confused, it's okay. Right. How do you guys think? Yeah. You guys enjoy? Do you want to yeah. come on to the, the oh. screen? Yeah, you guys can go yeah. over there. I'm going to do... Wait, do we lose? That, no. No, you won. You missed well, we it. Yeah. You, died. Wow. you missed it. You have to see the end. We the all died. died. And he, he got right. the epilogue. Okay. <laughs> you don't know right. Yeah, we got to do, I got to do a giveaway. Callie, give me the thing. Oh. Yeah, yeah. Go ahead and pull out New Salem. So sacrifice. Oh, this is a fancy giveaway for tonight. Oh yeah, it is. Ooh. All right. Just touch in. Here we go. I'm gonna drop the last one. Here we go. All right. This is the entire game plus the uh, this expansion pack thingy. This is uh, Jesse Cole. Jesse. Hey! Well done. <laughs> Go ahead and hit up unfilteredgamer.com slash winning. Go back crossing Olympus. Yeah. <laughs> and uh, enter in your address and all that good information that you'll need. Thank you so much. We'll do the Patreon stuff double next week, but because we're almost we're out of time here, we have to do all cleanup and whatnot. Uh, I will do double Patreon balls. Thank you guys for supporting me on Patreon. Uh, there should be new videos tom tomorrow for Patreon, as well as a new review out on my YouTube channel. Yeah, that's that's yeah. pretty much it. Thank you for DMing thank for you us. So much. Thank you for Yay. thank you all of you for playing so that I didn't have to. <laughs> <laughs> I did all the other stuff. Hopefully you guys appreciated a little bit of the extra camera work. I'm kinda hiding here. Actually, why don't I just pull this out all the way? I'll jump back in. Uh, uh, I, mean, I uh, checked your fridge. fridge. You have no beer at all. I know, that's because Anything. you can't smell there. I, I typed I'm the it was yeah, was autocorrect fine. kind of there you go. Was, like, fixed it for me. Bye. Nice to see you. Did I say bye? Right. Yeah, it's a bad one. Thank you for coming by. Do go ahead and check out Crossing Olympus on Kickstarter. The link is in the pinned comment. And if you're interested, there's, there's an email. Where, where's the site they can go to to put their email address in or whatever you want like that yet? Uh, don't worry no. about it. Just go pledge on the campaign or follow it and All get right. updates and stuff. Thank you so much for coming by like and my playing Facebook with page. us. Full booth games. <laughs> See you guys. See you. Thank you so Cheers, much. Man. Jump safe. <laughs> All right, that's it. That's that's pretty much it. I mean, we got we, Jesse Call one New Salem the, with the Constable expansion. Uh, when you go out, make sure you just go out all the way, uh, going the same way I, I took you. Okay. Yeah, yeah. All right. Um, so congrats to you for that. And uh, also, like I said, it was it was great doing RPGs with you guys. Did you guys enjoy it? Did yeah. you guys enjoy RPGs? Let us know in the comment section. Wants to do more of that, or maybe some uh, audience yeah. audience. Participation. So uh, many we've never done this before, so, so I've never done RPGs on Honestly, the stream. Yeah, so cool. never done it before, so I'm experience. <laughs> too many yeah. beers already. He only had one or two beers. He like sounds well, like he's. Very I had beer. one. No, I had one beer. It was like a double beer. It's like this large. <laughs> it's two and a half. It's yeah. it's a wine <laughs> bottle size, and it's sixteen and a half percent. Yeah, but it was a really like, good I don't beer. Want a DM drunk. <laughs> I was offering you like half of it. <sighs> you would not have gotten a joke. I'm a lightweight. 
Thank you. Stale. All right. Sure. Josh seems like you're a little bit of a lightweight too with your one beer. All right, give me this. All right, we're done. Not even. Ah, right, my phone. All right, we got this thing. Twenty-five people. How do we get more people after the show is ending? I still have not done. What's up? Right. Take him down. Take him out. Make sure he right, knows where okay. to go. Cheers, everybody. All right. Be careful. Don't break my shiz. <laughs> fa fa oh, okay. family, family friendly. friendly stuff. Okay, looks like we're going. Twenty-five people. What are you guys doing? Anyway, we do a giveaway. Next week we'll do doubles uh, for the Patreon stuff, and I'll have some more games to give away. And another interesting, uh, hopefully, guest will be coming by next week. Yeah, that's it. You had fun? Yeah, it was fun. Next week. Christmas. Yeah. <laughs> what do you think? We don't do the stuff on Christmas? Christmas you might, you stream. Might be playing Christmas game stream. Alone on Christmas you. stream. <laughs> that's cool. Right. Do we have enough dice here? <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. This is all this crazy stuff. I think we're done. Anything else I gotta say? Unfiltergamer.com. Go watch my videos on YouTube. Dang it. And share them. Dang it. Get we need more up. subscribers. Dang Subscribe it. on YouTube. More thumbs up. More views. More thumbs up. Yeah, <laughs> just go and thumbs up all of them. <laughs> the thing now won't even let me close the thing now. Who is your favorite character in in D and D? I want to know which one of these four were you most impressed with. I'd probably say not Josh, Josh, but he did do some damage. Most entertaining. Why did you guys not just leave with the orb? There were so many know. explanations as to why you should leave. Because we weren't Josh, sure what to do. Josh literally had a card that said, get the fire yeah, but it's he off the city. Yeah, he didn't tell us that. Yeah, he didn't tell us that. Josh didn't communicate. Why didn't we tell? We didn't know if we had we to kill why? Dragger or what. Ask Josh. He's not He's here. drunk. He's thinking and he's crazy. And he was weakened, so I'm like, okay, well, maybe he's easier to kill now. As yep. as it got farther away, That's he called said, meta gaming. But if you used your brain and he said, "Oh, as the thing moved farther away, you noticed his body got weaker." It's like maybe you want to take it to the. And he's like, "Oh, you can go down the stairs, you know, guy. You I go down the bad stairs." My perception like, check. You're, you're pushing them to continue the story, and they're just like, "Fight, <laughs> fight them." <laughs> bad rolls, you know. Yeah. All right, bye. guys. Hey. Hurry, bye. See you later before Josh gets here. Bye. Bye. No, you didn't. Ah. See you next Damn time. it.